Just tell me if you can hear me. Hello, this is I Bring It Every Day with Kelly and welcome to Food Fridays. So thank you so much for coming and let's see who we have here. We have some people. Yes. All right. So uh, let me just say hello real quick. We have uh, Tiger Dragon Girl. Welcome in. Thank you from the Squirrel Raid. And I'm saying hi to everybody. <laughs> we got Lydia. Lydia took a nap. Okay. Good for you. All right. Everyone's saying hi. And uh, VJ. Good to see you. Good to see you. How are you doing? All right. Okay. Awesome. Let's see. Yep. So we got a few people. So thank you so much for coming. Um, today, we're going to continue our... Um, sort of like do takeout at home and try to do it healthy and uh, natural. That's the evil plan. So I hope you guys enjoy it. So we're going to do pizza. So let's see, the first week um, we talked about um, like the Philly cheesesteaks. We talked about doing those, you know, from scratch. Um, we did Panera. Uh, we, you know, Panera, we, I did the bowl, the Mediterranean bowl, as well as the, um, oh my goodness. Of the sandwich. Yeah, the turkey avocado BLT sandwich. And then um, this week, so we're going to talk a little bit about pizza. Yeah. So that's what we're doing. So I made, so the whole thing with the pizza is there's a lot of prep involved, just like to warn you. And um, so I had to do a lot of this sort of pre-prep, <laughs> little sort of behind the scenes. So, um, oh, we got Debbie. Good to see you. And uh, Lydia saying Hello. And uh, VJ's got the Raiders. Yes. Yes. She's saying, welcome to Lydia and all the Raiders. That's nice. And we got uh, Brent Michelle, who the knitter. Good to see you. So, yes, yes, yes. So, oh, we got Regina. Nice. And we got Zoila. Good to see you. Thank you so much for coming. All right, now. This is great. So, anyway, so what we're doing, like I said, we're going to do some pizza. Um, I did not do a... Uh, Doing pizza dough is really tricky because you have to use yeast and you have to let it rise a couple of times. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to roll out the pizza dough that I made, and then you're, you'll kind of see, hopefully, just the idea. And the nice thing is pizza dough is pretty simple, and there are a lot of different recipes on um, on the internet, you know, regarding uh, any of the websites. So there's 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 a ton you can use. So you can try them all. And I would say that's like the best thing to do. I did a really, really simple one. Um, we're doing like one pizza, <laughs> which is not a lot. I know we're only two people. So it, it kind of makes you feel like we, we feel like we have to sort of cut down on the food so we don't have waste. That's our evil plan. Yes. But anyway, Jeanette, good to see you. Oh, the oven's preheated. All right. So my planning actually worked out. <laughs> yep. And uh, Regina, good to see you. She's saying hi to all the people couple people there. Yep. Lydia's saying hi. We got Not the End. Good to see you. Squirrel Ray. Nice. Oh, Nana Michelle. Hey, haven't seen you in a while. Good to see you. Lots of squirrels. Let's see how many. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 13. <laughs> Looks like. <laughs> and there's Joy. Hey, welcome in. Oh, just make sure the uh, module. Yeah, that's good. Yes, thank you. I just thought about that. Just see where it's at. Make sure it's good. Yes, yes. All right. So then, okay, so everyone's, oh, that's saying welcome. Nightbot's welcoming everybody. And it should wake up in a minute. It looks like it just woke up. Yes, lots of lots of squirrels. Yeah. Now, I was always in the squirrel squad, but now I'm in one of the squads. I can't remember. I have to find out which one I'm in. I just, I, that's, I was gifted a membership, so that's very exciting. And there's Dory. Good to see you. Yes. And there's Maura. Hey, welcome in. Mindfully crocheted. Yes. And let's see, Nana Michelle, everyone's saying hi. And uh, good. Okay. So I am going to have to tweak my night bot. But anyway, just check out. Thank you for coming for uh, Food Fridays. Good. So anyway, so like I said, today's pizza day. I am uh, re... Uh, I'm just trying to give you some good tips on some of the things that you can make at home. So I'm going to do a homemade pizza crust. And then I'm going to do... A pizza crust we found today in the Dollar Tree, which is very exciting. <laughs> yes. And the, and the ingredients were not that bad. So we're like, yay. So anyway, we have, let's see. There we go. Cynthia, Squirrel Ray, good to see you. 
I'm gonna make sure I got everybody. Darcia, yes, four squirrels. <laughs> She's got four. Shangy girl, hey, hey, you there? Yes, good to see you. And uh, she's saying hey to all the people in the chat box. Cool. And Dory, nice. Hearts and pizza. Yes. <laughs> so I'm going to show you my my dough that I made. And um, yeah. Oh, thank you. Yep. So anyway, I this is basically, uh, I'm going to have to put the, uh, so anyway, I, I wrap this. Usually what you do, I don't know if you guys have made pizza dough or dough of any kind. But pretty much what you have to do is you have to dissolve the yeast first. And it's usually like whatever the little packet is. I think the packet they say is about two and a quarter teaspoons of yeast if you have the uh, stuff in the jar. And then what you do is you dissolve it in the amount of water that they tell you. You put a little dash of sugar. You don't have to. But what you do is you froth it up. And then you just let the yeast kind of do its magic in, in slightly warm water. Oh, there's Granny D. Thank you for coming. Yay. I appreciate you coming in. So, yes, yeah, sorry I went over. Oh, no, no, you're fine. Oh, getting the AC fixed. Nice. <laughs> oh, oh, you like the handyman? Two thumbs up. <laughs> oh, may I have that yellow thingy? Yes, thank you. Yeah, I'm going to um, I'm gonna have to probably put on some gloves because this is going to be messy. But anyway, so this is the this is the dough. Yeah, it really I think it's so humid that it got very it got very damp. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to add some flour to this. But this is the dough. I just did this in my um KitchenAid mixer. So yeah, there it is. So what I'm gonna do then, I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to roll this out and then put it in the pizza pan. So what do you guys like with your pizza? Yeah, good to see you. And who the knitter? Oh no, no, you're fine going over. I mean, I'm I'm you know. It's all good. Yep. So anyway, I'm just checking on the chat. And if you see anything, uh, let me know. Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay. Cool. Thank you. All right. So um, what I got here was some mozzarella cheese. So anyway, so we're going to do, my, my husband and I like plain pizza. So we just do cheese pizza. We're not real exotic with the pizza. Um, we used to be, but. Uh, I still like pepperoni. Yeah, pepperoni's okay. But it's pretty salty. Like I, I've really cut back on my salt intake. And things like that. So, yeah, it is what it is. Um, oh, boy. Oh, so anyway, I'll, I'll tell you this real quick. So I did leave some links in the chat uh, other than the uh, dough recipe. And um, I'll give you just a couple of things that you can use for the red sauce. Oh, yeah, I'll have to have you. Um, can you open this just quietly? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hang on a second. Let me just give it to you. Okay, here we go. Thank you. Over there. Yep. Okay, here we go. Here, just pour that in there. Thank you. All right. Perfect. So all the veggies. Yes. Yes, spinach. Oh, okay. Okay. Look at that. All the veggies, spinach, and feta. Very nice. So these are some of the veggies I cut. I didn't get real exotic with the veggies, but I just have um, tomato, onion, and a little bit of baby... Uh, broccoli. And that's it. And then the mozzarella cheese. So that's all I'm doing. Nothing really. Oh, you like it all but the fishes? Yeah, I understand. Yeah, people love the, uh, what's that stuff called? A anchovy. Ooh. Yeah, it's a little scary. Okay. Regina, check you out. Can Canadian bacon, onion, pineapple is my favorite. Girl, that's pretty fancy. Remember Supremes? Supreme. Yeah, we like that bad pizza from Pizza Hut that you would get from the Target. <laughs> No, it's only at, it was only at the Pizza Hut. You can only get that. No, you can get it at the Target. Really? Yeah, we used to get it at the Target. We just no, love those little. It was BJ's. We used to get that. Oh, BJ's maybe. In yeah, the but hot they dogs too. in the hot dogs. Well, anyway, we ate some really bad stuff in the past, so we've been reformed. <laughs> You're lazy. Oh, just garlic, all the tomatoes and cheese. Yes, that's what we do. We basically do uh, pouring um, cheese pizza. <laughs> Let's see everyone saying hi. Yes, we have similar tastes. <laughs> Don't see ya. That's cool. Oh, taco. Oh, taco pizza. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Yeah, that's not bad. I, you know, it's funny. I haven't done anything like that lately. So we'll see what happens. All right now. Oh, and then show them. Can you open that, please? I'll give you a scissor. Oh. That thing. And then I forgot to open that. Yeah, just, yeah. You can just, I'll give you a, like a knife. But see if you can. Oh, you got it. Okay, good. But I'll show you the pizza crust that we got from the Dollar Tree, which is interesting. All right. So 
So this is what it looks like here. I'll show it here. Oops. You can see that ultra thin pizza crust. Yes. Now put it here. And then uh, you can hold that. Just hold that right there. Just for a second. Yep. Uh, this way. And this way. Mm -hmm. yep. There it is. It was there. <laughs> yeah, there it is. No, no, I have to change it. Okay, hold that just for a second. Mm -hmm. Two hands. Yeah. yeah. Only because I got to, I'm going to switch uh, pictures here. Let's put it here. Hold on. I'm going to do this picture here. I forgot to, let me see if I can get this to scroll down. Yeah, my fingers are not working today. Oh boy. Of course it's not working today. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> oh, anyway. But anyway, you see that there. <laughs> I'll, I'll fix that in just a second. You, you can just put it down over there, please. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're good. Okay. <laughs> so anyway, that's the evil plan. Now, the one thing you can do, there's two things you can do for the sauce. Um, one of my uh, friend's grandmother was from Italy, and she used to just buy spaghetti sauce and use that as the red sauce, which I was like, really? <laughs> and she was off the boat from Italy, and she said, yeah have time to make sauce that was her thing that's what she said um <laughs> now another thing that you can do let me see if i can make myself solo here we go yeah 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 so i'll show you this too um there we go um is this so you just get tomato paste you get a saucepan and tomato paste kind of gives it like a real so really tomato paste is only really two things it's tomatoes and a little bit of citric acid or, you know, to make, give it like a salty taste, but that's it. I mean, it's really, really unprocessed. So you can make a pretty good sauce out of tomato paste. And then if you want, you can throw some oregano, basil, things like that in there to make it. Yeah. So anyway, so yeah, so that's what, that's what you can do. So anyway, yeah, but I was really surprised that she would just buy, you know, ragu sometimes. And I was like, Oh, ragu. <laughs> But that was her deal. Yeah. Yep. But making your own is the best if you can. And, you know, if you have some tomatoes, like these tomatoes, we have to eat this. Um, I probably should have done this before. But see this nice tomato here? It's been smushy. It's getting smushy. So we got, we're going to have to probably make this into some more sauce later on. Sandwich. Sandwich or something. No, it's really <laughs> smooth. Yeah, I don't think you want to put that on a sandwich. You'll, you'll, get a, you'll get a bath. Mm. Let's see. Oh, yes. So you have a tomato paste. Uh, recipe, you don't have to cook it. Delish. Yes. Oh, okay. Dory said, oh, she's tried it. Oh, okay. Are you, you have, you have, yeah, the dollar store crust looks pretty good. I mean, I'm kind of like, okay. So we're going to do a, we're going to do a veggie one on the, on the uh, Dollar Tree crust. We're just going to do a regular old cheese one on the one I made. So hopefully this goes okay. We'll see. And see, Nana Michelle has a recipe. Yeah. You don't have to cook. Oh, nice. Yeah. I mean, tomato paste, I think is really delicious. And it's a good tomato base if you don't have tomatoes. And right now, like our tomatoes have been, eh, you know, it's not been a good summer for us. But anyway, but uh, we need to go to dinner together. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's right. That's right. Oh, Angela, Precious World, good to see you. So we'll welcome in everybody that's coming in. And let's see, uh, I do too, I do Yarn Lover Regina and my own spaghetti sauce. Yeah, that's really the best. Must have been Italian in the past life. LOL. Yeah, I understand that. And, uh, Nancy's little treasures by Nancy saying hello. Good to see you. We got Tamika. Hey. Yes. Yeah. Good crust. Yeah, okay. So this is our first time. You know, we figure we give it a try. What the heck? You know, we'll mix in some homemade. We'll mix in some not homemade, but it's actually pretty soft. So I'm kind of feeling that right now. Okay. So anyway, let's see what happens. Um <laughs> so right now, hopefully this won't take long. I think. Once I do the uh, crust, and I'm hoping this thing behaves, and sorry about the crinkle. Oh, you know what I need to do? And maybe I can have you, if you can come, come this way, I'm going to have you do something real quick. Um, so anyway, so I, I have some links in the, um, in the chat. Can you just enable all of these? See, enable, and then you just do that real quick. Just be real easy. Yep. I have to turn that back on right here. Oh. All of them? Yeah. Um, the, just the people's names. Yeah, that this one here. Oh, my. Uh, yeah, just keep going. Yeah, just keep going down. Look, you'll see the name. Yep, thank you. I had to turn that off last night because of the... Uh, okay. I'm re I have to re-enable all my members' names. Anybody else? It keeps, you have to scroll. 
Yes, we'll just keep uh, going. Yep, yep. And hopefully uh, your links will start dropping. Instagram? Yeah, uh, you can you can put that on there. That's fine. Okay. Yeah, just keep going. And then you, Facebook? Uh, you skip. Just keep going the names. This one. Uh, no, this one. Yep. Here, yes. here. No, no. Oh, Ursa, no yep, no. yep, yep. Yep, do that one. Some of yep. Mm -hmm. yep, keep going. So, mm -hmm. Yep, yep, keep going. Yep. There you go. Thank you so much. Hello. Yep. <laughs> keep going. I didn't say hello to anyone. Yeah. <laughs> Just keep going. Yep. I'm going to put some, uh, and I think that should do it. Yep, yep, yep. And I'm just going to put some, a uh, little bit of flour because this is, it's very, very warm today. So I'm going to have to unfortunately put so much flour to get this to soften up. Mm -hmm. Yep, keep going. Yep. Yep, just keep going. Yep, thank you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then just X that tab, just the tab. Don't X the window. Yep, thank you. Forgot to do that before I started. Um, yeah, I just want to make sure everybody's link drops. Cool. Yes, yes. And then you can just type Kelly to drop your link. Yep. Yep. Uh, you can skip. Go here. Uh, skip. Uh, disable. This one? This one. Oh, uh, okay. Got yeah, it. yeah, yeah. Disable. Disable. Enable. And then scroll down a little bit more. And there should be like two more. Yeah. And that's it. Oh, yeah, one more right there. Mm -hmm. Yep. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. And then just close that tab, just the tab, please. Okay, perfect. All right, excellent. Thank you. I need a little computer help. <laughs> okay, so let me switch over the cameras here. And then we should be good. All right. I forgot to turn everybody on. Yes, Mr. Bringen, how are you doing? Okay, there we go. So now, <laughs> yes. Hey. Hey. <laughs> I have to do a little, I had to do a little extra help there. How you doing? How you doing? <laughs> All right, so I'm going to take this out. So I'm just going to put a little bit of uh, flour on here. You're welcome, Joy. This is a lot of flour. <laughs> Lots of flour. Way too much flour. But this really got, uh, right now it's like 85 degrees. So it's pretty warm. It is warm as whatever. So this is a little bit doughy. So this, I don't know, it's going to probably stick. <laughs> but it is what it is. You know, we do the best we can. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. All right. Let's see how we doing. So, and now this this uh, dough has a little bit of olive oil in it to uh, make it, uh, put a little bit of flavor. Now, one of the things they recommended was to... Um, Put a little bit of garlic powder or garlic salt in there, which I didn't do. So this is gonna be gonna be a little bland, but we're gonna heat up the pizza. We're gonna do some fun stuff with the pizza. But anyway, there it is. Okay, looking pretty good. All right. And uh, you want to read the chat? See if anybody's uh, anything's going on. Mm, Let's see. Oh, story. thanks for hitting the thumbs, Dory. Yeah, yeah. I, for yeah, that's right. Holmes, yeah. did it. Yes. All and right. I, uh, hey, Mr. Brent, how you doing? How you doing? <laughs> <laughs> and Joey said thank you. <laughs> and uh, hit that thumbs up. Yes, please hit the thumbs up. Thank you. I appreciate it. So anyway, but this looks good. This dough is not bad. I'm kind of digging this. All right, now. This came out okay. So, and it's basically two cups of flour, um, like a cup, and, a cup and a quarter of water, the yeast, a little bit of salt. And that's it. I didn't even put sugar in it, <laughs> which normally you're supposed to. I, I did not. I just refused to do that. Because I said, I'm trying to watch the sugar intake, but it's tricky. Now, let's see. Oh, today. Oh, one more thing. Well, let me put this in here. And uh, can you guys guess what today's... Today, we're going to do the food of the day. Can anybody guess what that is? How you doing? <laughs> Let me put this down here. Oh, okay. Oh, I forgot to put the comment. Let me put that down for a second. Let me hide that comment. Anyway, I'll come back to that. But I like the feta cheese. All right. So let's see here. Let me oh. go. What? Joy wants to see you uh, toss and spin the pizza. Uh, oh. Um. Mm. <laughs> Do you want to? You you want me to like fail? Epic fail. <laughs> 
I'm afraid of that. I mean, I thought about it, like, but I never, I have not done it because I'm afraid to uh, drop it. But anyway, let, let me put this in here. Okay. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh, I feel a sneeze. Uh-oh, that's not good. Okay. So anyway, so today, the food of the day, can anybody guess? This is the food of the day. So the food of the day, let's see if any, if any guesses. Anybody know what that is? What is the food of the day? Let me see. I'll hide that. So anyway, so that's going to be a little new segment that we're going to do. So today, because we're doing all this pizza, we're going to do, uh, let's see if anybody guessed. Here, let me go back to the chat. <laughs> uh -oh, what happened? Dave. Cheetos. Cheetos. Um, no, Dave. <laughs> How are you? Why, why am I not surprised? <laughs> he likes Cheetos. They are really, like, addictive. I think it's that yellow. You can't stop at one. I know. Yeah, you can't stop at one. So anyway, the food of the day is, let me see if it'll go in here, the tomato. So um, this is the USDA website. And this basically what you can do is you can plug it in. I put the link in the chat. And what it does is it'll give you the nutritional values of about 100 grams. It defaults to 100 grams of whatever item. So this is the Roma tomato. You go to the next one here. So, oh, this is hard to read. But anyway, um, let's see here. It is hard to read. I can't make this bigger. It was bigger on my screen. But you see, this is all the nutritional, about 22 calories for 100 grams of tomatoes, which is not that bad. And, um, and then these are all the nutritional things that are available in the tomato. And so the tomato's not too bad. I mean, anything in moderation, but just so you sort of know, this is what's in aroma tomato. These are the minerals, calcium, magnesium, uh, potassium, sodium, zinc, copper. So, you know, you're getting all kinds of minerals, you know, when you eat a tomato. And let's see, vitamin C, obviously, let's see, riboflavin, what else we got? Vitamin B, yeah, like all these things, folate. So tomato is a decent, nutritious item. So just something to think about, you know what I mean? And you can always go to this USDA website. You just plug in, I think, the, the, hopefully the link that I left works. And, and it, there's like a little open space. You just type in what you want. And that gives you uh, things to think about. And in any, you know, in any, t any food type. And, and actually, there's some branded stuff in there. And there's some just basic foods, uh, like tomatoes, onions, things like that. But today, because we're working with a tomato, that's what we're doing. All right. So let me remove that. You got Maritza in. Oh, hey. Hola. <laughs> <laughs> so let me take that out of there. So that's the food of the day. So it's, a, it's the tomato. Last week we we talked about, was that the avocado? I think, so. I think we did the avocado last mm -hmm. week. Yeah. Anyway, so let's get back. Well, let me see if I can get this pizza crust in here. And I'll, I don't know. It's, it's a little sticky today because it's very, very warm. You know, so they said tomato with lingua. My friends need me at breakfast. So now, what is that? What's lingua, Dave? You, you just can't drop it on the Yeah, you got to tell us. Explanation. Come on, Dave. <laughs> okay. I'm just going to spread, spread this out as best that I can. This may not be. Hopefully, I'm pronouncing that right. Yeah. <laughs> lingua. Lingua. Let's see here. And I just used, um, what kind of flour is oh, this? Lingua. Cow tongue. Oh, cow tongue. No, no, I don't like cow tongue. I'm like, you oh, see me, I'm going, oh, lingua. Okay. oh, lingua. You said lingua. I, I, <laughs> it I, sounded I, like something good. Lin, yeah. Um, yeah. Now, this lin, pizza trick, no, I needed more. Lingua. See, you told me not to make more. <laughs> I, yeah. Yeah. Okay. I, I looked at this and I went, this he isn't a like lot a, of pizza. You said like a juicy steak. Like a juicy steak. Oh, okay. All right. So, this is what we're going to do. I'm just going to do this like this. Yeah, it is so sticky right now. This is a big. This is a big pan. I mean, did you flour the pan? I did. Mm. Yeah, it's 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 so humid. It's the humidity. Mm. So anyway, I'm just gonna have to. Mm. This. But well, this is what this is like. Summertime. Mm -hmm. Summertime cooking is is definitely challenging. But let me just see if I could just roll this just a little bit here. Yeah, it is really sticking. But there it is. We got it in the pan. I'm just going to try to do a little thing to fold over the edge so we don't have a rolling edge. But anyway, so there it is. We got it in there. But yeah, this pan is too big <laughs> for the amount of flour. But that's okay. It'll be good. So I'm just going to put a little hump on the end here. You want a cup, a small, smaller cup to roll it out? 
Yeah, that might be better. Yeah. Yeah, I rolled this earlier, but I'll tell you, it is hot. But it's looking pretty good. I'm just going to put it in there. Oh, actually, no, I think we're good. Yeah, it just, you know, it's funny. It just needed a, um, I think it's just a little more flour. Yeah. Because this came out really good. But look at, yeah, that looks good. Yeah. Lango. I don't know. I don't know. I was like, oh, lango. You said lengua. I'm like, I, I thought that was lango. something. Oh, lengua. Oh, lengua. <laughs> You know, I really thought that was Hawaii. It's not, it's not something that I go to. My brain goes to. Oh, I forgot to move. Put the bigger one on. Hold on. I forgot to change sides here. But this is looking much better. Here we go. Let's see. All right. Yeah. Oops. Langua. Yeah. <laughs> I was yeah, like, my what? Brain is not... <laughs> I'm sorry. That's funny. I was. <laughs> You're like Langua. What the heck is Langua? But you know what? When we say lengua, it's L E G. We don't. It is. We yeah. Don't really do the N. So when seeing the spelling. Yeah, I was like, okay, I thought that was something really exotic. But yeah, anyway, here. It, it, it took a minute. <laughs> I got it. After, after he said cow I'm like, oh, lengua. oh, lengua. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. All right. It happens. <laughs> All right. Sorry. I, I just have to laugh. That was pretty good. Hey, Granny D. What's up? All right. This does look good. All right. That's better. All right. Yes, this is going to be good. All right, beautiful. There we go. So it's looking good. All right. So now, oh, now can you hand me that thing of sauce? The... Mm -hmm. Yes, that's it. Yep. There's the sauce. And I'm just going to put it in there. <clears throat> Forgot a spoon. We're going to do a spoon. And I'm just going to do like they do in the pizzeria. Hopefully they can see that. Mm, yeah, it looks good. Yeah, yeah, yeah It's in the yeah, shot. Yeah, yeah. I finally like got the camera where it should be mm -hmm. <laughs> for a change. I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna need more. I was thinking it was. I was gonna here. Yep, yeah. a little bit more, and I'm just gonna put should it in. Just pour it out. Yeah, I should have just yeah. Pour it out. Pour it out. And I'm try not to be too you know messy. But anyway, there it is. It looks good. You got yeah. cheese and stuff. Wait, I'm getting there. One step at a time. <laughs> Sauce yeah. first. She's now. She's now. Okay. Now, that looks good. I think that's gonna be. And and my and my friend's um grandmother from Italy would say, "Don't make it too dry." She would say, "Put more sauce on there." Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I actually remember hearing her voice. She was funny. But anyway, she's in heaven right now. But she was cool. Make that bird swim. Make it swim. Okay. <laughs> All right. So now, let's get the. Uh, I'm gonna put a little garlic in here. You always said looking good. Yes. Yeah, I'm telling you, like this uh, making sauce is scary. Miss Queen Sunkis is in. Oh hey, welcome in. Dory, get it. Dory, I'm putting some garlic, just chopped up garlic here. Yeah, Regina says she don't like dry pizza either. I know. Yeah, dry pizza is terrible. It's like if anybody has ever noticed how pizzerias are now like. It's getting more expensive. Yes. But you're not getting as much, or it's not as good. Yep. I yep. Noticed. Yeah. It's like they're getting really stingy with the ingredients. Well, everyone, have you noticed, like, have or, you gone out to eat lately? Anybody? Anywhere? Anybody? Anybody? <laughs> Pizza Hut. Uh, Dave said Pizza Hut is his favorite. Yeah. I like when you can go into, into the actual restaurant, like, when they had the forever, uh, the endless salad bar. And is that what salad. they had? It was like the yeah. salad bar, or you can make a snack bar, too. Like, yeah. Can, I love when they were, like, mm -hmm. in full swing. These little Pizza Hut dudes. Not cutting but we used to like to go to um, BJ's warehouse. Oh yeah, and just eat their pizza. But like, and then Target picked up on that. Yeah, and that was exciting. Yeah. So anyway, but anyway, so now I'm just opening the mozzarella the cheese. Donuts are skimping on the icing these days. <laughs> Where? Oh, are where's talking, he talking are about? You talking about are, you, are we still on Pizza Hut? Or are you talking about D and D? Uh, I think yeah. Or, or, I don't or know. is it the um? No, because the only one that does the snacks I thought was a. Uh, Dominoes with the uh, what are you talking about? The cinnamon, but the cinnamon sticks. Do they have cinnamon sticks? I don't know. I don't, we don't go there, yeah. So I have no idea. Yeah, the cinnamon yeah. sticks were like awesome back in the day. We had, um, we have like you know, as I've said, uh, we have a lot of like I said, people say that you can only get pizza in New York. Uh, no, you can't. <laughs> There's so many Italians in and around Philadelphia. Oh, hey, John, welcome in. I cannot get this open. Do you mind? 
I, I think I need a pair of scissors. I don't know why. Yeah, yeah, the thing is, I'm having trouble here. <laughs> yeah, this thing's tight, isn't it, crazy? Oh my goodness! <laughs> you know, Dick said I jumped into this for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, I was like, "Are we talking about this?" <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. So this is just generic mozzarella cheese, oh, you know, that you get yeah. wherever you get it. And I'm just gonna, you know, and I'm heavy-handed with it. So this is what we're doing. And Joey said they have three within 30 minutes. So, yeah, I don't, I don't know. They're okay, but it's kind of like a... It's, what are you talking about? Uh, uh, Dunkin' Donuts? Uh, uh, no. Uh, now you got me like this. Sorry. Pizza Hut. <laughs> oh, Pizza Hut. So they closed all the Pizza Huts yeah, all here. Yeah, all the big stores. like they They're gone. Like the yeah. restaurants are mm -hmm. gone. And they have some of those delivery things. Yeah, like you got to drive up, pick it up yourself, we'll get it delivered. Yeah, they do that. But that's about it. But that's all we got. It's yeah. not the same. It's not the same. It's like, what, what, what am I thinking? Pizza Hut from circa 2000 or what? Well, any time before, any, any the, time before. the pandemic. <laughs> well, before, I want to say any time before t uh, t uh, 2010. Really? Yeah. I mean, yeah. that's how long Pizza Hut has not been good. <laughs> or um, any places, really. Because they're stingy. I mean, like, they barely put any cheese on there. And then you're just like, can I have some more? <laughs> I'm like, like Oliver, and, can uh, I have Logan some more? Said, Personally, for P Detroit pizza. De no, no. Tell us what's the difference. Yeah, okay. fill us in on Detroit. John's Pizza New York is off the hook. Okay, okay. Well, I mean, yeah. Yeah, it's it's. Yeah. I've never had Detroit pizza. But... No, I don't think I have either. Hmm. All right. So, in any way, I'm gonna put this in the oven because it's done. That we like plain pizza. We do cheese pizza. We're real boring. But there it is. <clears throat> <laughs> that looks good. But the big ones were Pizza Hut, Papa John's, mm -hmm. and Domino's. Yeah. Yep. All right. Let me get rid of this guy. Ooh. Oh, in Chicago. Is it Chicago? Chicago has good yeah, pizza, Chicago but it's very, pizza. very, 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 very thick. Like, the crust is ridiculous. Like, I I love bread, and even I was like, whoa, this is too much bread. <laughs> That's what I used to say. Don P. Oh, hey, Don. Hello, Don P. Hello. And Dave said, yes, cheese pizza. Yeah. <laughs> I know I like pepperoni and want if I can ever find a good uh supreme. Yeah. I love supreme. We used to love supreme. Yeah, we used to eat that all the time with all the sausage and bacon and all that stuff. Don't she says she's a cheese pizza all the way. Your cheese pizza? Okay. BNC Garden is in. Oh, welcome in. So this is the taller tree pizza uh crust. We found this today. We're like, woohoo, we'll try it. So this one we're gonna do a veggie. Now this is really thin. Can I give you that? You can toss that. This is a, um, you see, it's almost like a flatbread. Yeah. They just look like someone put a big old piece of naan. Yeah, it's like, it looks like naan. <laughs> That's big right. old one of naan. Yeah, oh, can I throw that away? Here, here, yep. yep. So anyway, so we're going to do veggie, because that's what we sort of do on the other side. So I'm just going to do the same thing. Um, and this is, they say to put this at 425 for, I forget how many minutes now, I read it, until it's done. You, you might have to read that. <laughs> I forgot. I'm going to do the second one, and I'm going to come back to the chat. But this is all I'm going to do um, on this one. 425. For how long? 10 to 15 minutes. 10 minutes. Okay. So yeah, so this will be done in you know, like a few. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Yep. So anyway, there's the sauce. Oh, close this. More. Yes, please. Yep. And I'm going to need more cheese. I was like stingy Did with the cheese. you That's right there. No, no, I need more. Like... <laughs> Oh, like I use the yeah. There's, there's one more okay. pack in there. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yep. Yep. I was trying to be cute and uh, no, use. No, cute with cheese. I was, but I'm, I'm not using less. Yeah, that's just you, crazy. You know how I feel about munching Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so anyway, so like I said, you can be creative with your sauce. And the thing is, I always say, just make, put up, put, put on your pizza what you like. There you go. So I'm just gonna put a little on the edge here. Leave a little, leave a little bit for grabbing. Mm. And you can, if you can open it, that'd be great. Yep. I should have gotten maybe one more bag. I was really, um, I was being stingy. Yeah. See, I'm not real stingy. Don't be stingy. Girl, you got a ten piece piece. Don't be stingy. Or that. So has anybody had good luck with tomatoes this year in their garden? Because that's been like really sad. Let me give you that. What was it? So 
Dave said in Cali has pizza that can knock someone out if you hit them with it. Oh, it's like, it's like five pounds. Like, good God, five pound pizza. And That's John crazy. Said, Interesting. Tell me what you think. Yeah. Um, we, cheat. we have Italian restaurants that sells their pizza dough. Yeah. See, that's sometimes the way to go. That's you, the best, actually. Especially if you trust them. Yeah. The biggest thing why we started doing this is because we've seen way too many restaurants. Let's just say not very clean practices. Yeah. Let's just put it that way. Yeah. Not very clean practices. So it's enough to like, you know what? I don't trust these people. Do you want to tell them what happened? So we went to a yeah. a particular chicken joint that a customer ordered some certain pieces. Yeah. Wasn't what he ordered. And he was pointing them out, fingering up the chicken. <laughs> and uh, then the manager proceeded to touch the chicken as well. Like, oh, you don't want these, whatever. And then came to an agreement. He got his new chicken. The manager came, <laughs> grabbed the chicken, and put it back in with the other chicken to sell to other customers, which is enough to make me, like, never go there again. Yeah. So this, these are some of the reasons why we're saying you should probably eat at home. <laughs> make your, if you can, make if you your can. own stuff. Yeah, just if try. You can, just, yeah. Or just like observe what's going on in the background. Yes, don't, yes. Don't just look at the menu and wait for your food to show up. Yeah, just, just keep an eye on you know what's happening. It, it, it's bad enough when you hear someone coughing back there, then you perk up and you've already paid for your food. Yeah, it's yeah. It's kind of like too yeah. late. Yeah. Do you want to take your chances? So anyway, there's so it's a twofold thing. Yeah, it's a cleanliness thing and it's also a nutrition yeah. thing. And see, and I'm using just 100% uh, mozzarella cheese. I'm not doing anything, you know, exotic there. So that's it. So that's the, um, this is this is the Dollar Tree pizza. <laughs> Joyce says Hawaiian pizza is good. I like Hawaiian pizza. You like pizza. Hawaiian? I like Hawaiian every once in a while. I'm kind of like a snob. I'm it's, like, it's, no it's... fruit on my pizza. Sorry. <laughs> you know what? <sighs> These I are just know. red onions now. These are red onions. I don't want you to can see, see those pineapple. Yeah, just red onions. Yeah, well, I mean, I I like Hawaiian food, so I mean, I would like, you know, I like pineapple. It doesn't really, but I just like mm. I'm one of those. I'm a, like a purist. I need meat and cheese on my pizza. <laughs> they said love pineapple. Yes, pineapple's re it's really good for you too. You should look up the nutrition on pineapple. Pineapple's great. And John says yes, Jordan, my wife loves it too, but it's a real divide. It is a divide. Yes, <laughs> yes. I agree. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, John uh, just gifted five. I bring it every time. <gasps> John! Maritza. Let's see, you got him. Regina. Regina, Maritza. Don P. Don Little P. Treasure. Little Treasures by Nancy. And Steve? Yes, yeah, Steve. Okay. Yes, yeah, Steve's a crocheter. Hey, okay. Steve. We missed you. It's just like a... It's, like, it's, like it's really a, small. small. Yeah. Like, why did his come up small? Yeah, yeah I don't know. Does he, does he have a... He has a cat, right, on his um, avatar? It's real... It's... uh. Anyway, these are little cherry tomatoes. I'm putting up. Yeah, the, yeah. Yep. Hey, Steve. <laughs> so I'm gonna put a, th a few of these on here too. I'm just gonna look. So anyway, this is gonna be a veggie pizza, and these cherry tomatoes. This would probably be better with sun dried tomatoes, but we're gonna live dangerously, and um, because these cherry tomatoes were good. So I went to the store, and um, this was the winner. No, oh, he says what? You're not grating <laughs> in the cheese. <laughs> oh no, I did not. <laughs> Yes, uh, tomato is a fruit. It is, yeah. Supposedly, I don't know. Does it matter though? <laughs> Some people lose their minds when they yeah. have to like. I think I learned that in some grade. Six, yeah. six, you learn it like really sixth young. Sixth grade. Yeah. And then there were parents like, "It's a vegetable," and it's like, and then they were like, "Big girls on a vine. It's a fruit." But it's it's a know, vine. Oh yeah, it is it's, a vine. It's, it's a vine. Yeah, it is. It's, it's all about the vine. Oh wait a minute, no, it's not always though, because some are vines, right? So, yeah. Some are vines and some are like little plants. Some. Yeah. Well, anyway, for John. But, but thank you, John. Yes. <laughs> Back to the uh, situation. Yes. Sorry. <laughs> the important thing. And we got sidetracked. Yeah. This is called ADD, even though I haven't been officially diagnosed. <laughs> and then Angelie's Inventory. Oh, yes. King. Yes. Oh, hey. Long time no see. Good to see you. And Darcy. Right? Yeah, she's been there. Yeah. Okay. So I'm just throwing yeah. some broccoli. And they had these baby broccolis at uh, what was the store? Lidl, 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 Lidl. Okay, so Lidl. bam, that's the vegetarian pizza. So I'm gonna check on the other one. Hopefully, I didn't burn it. We'll see. <laughs> and then I'll go back to the chat. And um, and thank you so much, John. All right. 
And then Joey says, I was taught that the stem and leaves and root are vegetables, the part that reproduces seed is fruit. Ah, so maybe there's a little bit of both going on with Probably. the uh, tomato. Yes. Okay. Let me get rid of him. This is my um, Fred Flintstone, you know, hit your husband over the head with the fright, with the rolling pin. Remember, she, she did that one time. No, mm -hmm. she did it with a cast iron pan. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> She's so strong. She's so strong. <laughs> Remember that? Oh boy, this is like a hot mess. But anyway, let me see what's going on over here. Uh, glove. Oh, here we go. Here's the glove. Let me make sure. Got to use the glove. <laughs> oh, that was in there. Rocking Star Wars. Yes. Oh. Oh. Is it? Oh. Oh goodness. Wow. Ah! <laughs> there it is. Wow, that is beautiful. Mm -hmm. Oh, maybe a couple more seconds just on the crust, but that looks pretty good. Yeah. All right. I looked at that and I went, I think it's done. Mm -hmm. All right. So now mm -hmm. toppings. Do you guys do toppings on your pizza? What I mean by toppings are like a lot of people do, they'll sprinkle some Parmesan cheese on there <laughs> or, or they'll put red peppers. A lot of times when you go to the pizzeria, that's what they give you. Wow, this is amazing. So Donna says, I took those New Mexico chilies and put it in a white chicken chili. Oh, that and sounds really good. We'll put it in the pork chili, too. Oh, okay. New Mexico chili. All right. Wow. Chilies. Chilies. Okay. Didn't we buy some, some like, ghost peppers? We did, and I forgot to cut them. We'll have to get those. Yeah, we, we got some ghost peppers. They were, like, $2.00 for um like three or four which is pretty good can't stop walking oh okay yeah. now are you are you driving can't stop walking he's he's cheesing it up he's, he has that. a lot of cheat yeah a lot of teeth he's been very a very good mood i'm very happy <laughs> red, peppers? red peppers yes so uh let's Mara see said, uh, shredded parmesan cheese and red sauce dollops yes oh she puts like a little bit more mm -hmm. so there's the uh, red peppers and so these are looking pretty good. Says we love our green chili here in Colorado. Oh, oh nice. Green chili. Green right. chili. You guys are fancy. Yeah, we're not that fancy here. And Michelle says parm cheese, garlic, salt, and red pepper. Garlic pepper. salt. Ooh. After I cook my pizza. Yeah, we got the red garlic salt. I don't know. Do you want me to get the goose pepper back? I mean, you could. We'd have to cut them, though. But anyway, I'll give you this cheese back because okay. it's going to melt. It is so hot. Thank you. Woo. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to wipe them. Uh, hmm? Did we use all of these oh ones? yeah yeah oh, that one's gone oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. remember i told you yes yeah, okay. that i used like eight maybe eight and four <laughs> 12 ounces of cheese lots of cheese, cheese. i gotta wipe this off this is this looks terrible cheese. but anyway it's all flour but that's it that was um steve urkel, <laughs> oh, yeah. urkel. no he would say got any cheese did I do that? I love cheese. Anyway, that's that's a, the situation. <laughs> okay. So anyway, so John, let me see if I can. I'm going to wipe that off. But in the meantime, I'm just going to make sure I don't burn this pizza. Uh, oh, it looks good. Don't pizza in my three. Do uh, you put red sauce under the cheese? And then... Yes. Yes. That's what we do. John said, yeah, it's my favorite time of the year. Because we also have a local world famous peach and sweet corn. Ooh, all right. All right. There it is. Yeah, that's good. Oh, it's perfect. <laughs> Bam! So there it is. Okay. So that's the first pizza. And then Don is asking if you ever had Detroit style pizza. No. I no. don't remember. I don't think so. Either. We used to go to Detroit. See, I have family in Detroit, and we used to go there all the time. But I don't recall us eating pizza, which is I, interesting. I, I was in Chicago, but I don't remember the Detroit pizza. Chicago, you'll never forget because it's so thick. Like it's well, got like a. An inch of stuff on the bottom. Also fifteen, so yeah, yeah, it's been a while. Yeah, but um, I just remember that was a lot. You know what I mean? It just so much. <laughs> John was like, I asked them to. Yeah, no, it's they can't remember. It's, yeah, it's honestly, I haven't been to Chicago in a very long time. And same here. Yep, yep. It's but Chicago, good. like my. <laughs> Dave said, did someone say corn? Mm. Um, no, my old company was in Chicago, and. They took us, they they brought lunch one day and they bought about 30 pizzas and we only ate like five of them. 
it was about a room of 20 people and they only ate five pizzas. And I thought, what a shame. <laughs> like these things went to waste. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But there is, there's the pizza. So anyway, but let me, let me, let me go over here. I'm going to. Someone said, is that corn? Is that corn? And John is like, it's corn. <laughs> Sorry, I have to laugh. <laughs> DJ is like, Donkey, I had it for the first time last year from Buddies. Okay. Yes. Was it good? It was good. Wow, there's 110 comments that I'm behind <laughs> on my screen. And then someone is like, it's corn. It just got the juice. Oh. John said, it's got the juice. It's got... <laughs> John said, LOL. LOL. <laughs> Donkey's like, yes, put the dollop in the sauce at the top instead oh, of the cheese. Oh, my goodness. Where is Okay. Cool when we need it. <laughs> I know, right? Thank you, John, for the membership. Yes. Dory did it yummy. Yes. Okay, so let me let me put this in. So this is for um thank you for becoming a member, everybody. <laughs> I have to go through the list again. Gracias. Gracias. Thank you, John. And that's basically a super chat. So there you go. Thank you for that super uh membership. <laughs> that's awesome. So Keep smiling, keep shining, knowing you can always count on me. For sure, that's what friends are for. In good times, in bad times, I'll be on your side forevermore. That's what friends are for. So thank you. <laughs> Let me give you this. <laughs> so apparently Dave, uh, John and Dave are refrenching a song about corn. Oh Lord! For another YouTube to use to sing. They are crazy. Yeah. Somebody <laughs> said that pizza looks yummy. It, it's 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 like amazing. Um, I'm gonna let it cool because it is very, very very hot. <laughs> you, you, you know me, just cut me. Oh, just cut your piece. Oh, okay. Your you, you know how to fry this. Right. You wanna um, you know how to cut this, right? You cut it. Okay. I, I gotta use my glove here. You know I'm gonna make a mess. Okay, and then I have to get back to the chat because I'm really sleeping on the job here. It's very sleepy here, but it's looking pretty good. Yes, this is a big piece. All right. Yes. Ooh. See if I can do this without causing a situation. Mayhem. Mayhem. It is a little bit of mayhem. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's sticking. Even though I put a mm, that little square thing. This guy. We'll use this guy. Actually, this that's a good knife there. I'm gonna use this guy. This isn't the best, but here goes. Oh man, I should have broke out the R2D2. Oh, I did not. Sorry, nerds. No. <laughs> I have an R2D2 pizza cutter, guys. Okay, right. Let me have your plate. Thank you. All right, now just put it under the camera so people can see. There we go. Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry, I'm trying to do it. Mm -hmm. Wait, there you go. There's the pizza. All right. Ta -da. That's his piece. And now, what now here, here? Here, here's red. Red. Oh yeah. Take that. You can get Parmesan if you want in there. And here's some garlic. I don't know if you want some more garlic. I put garlic on there, but some garlic powder. I always didn't have the oregano powder. Oh, oregano's here. Yeah. Oh. I was I was planning. Yeah, and I would suggest like if you're using sauce from external places, add some uh, uh, extra oregano and basil and maybe even more garlic yeah okay so let me go back <laughs> let me go back to the chat and uh put myself here but there's the pizza actually i'll leave him there yes i will yeah i'm getting ready to do that right now this is hot <laughs> i'm dying oh it's beautiful oh i think it's just about done i'm giving it a couple more seconds wow yeah that crust is good mm-hmm Let's see. Yeah. Let me see. Hang on just a second here. All right. I'm going to go to the chat. It's corn. It's got juice. Okay. Now, what tune is that? Is that good? Okay. So he likes it. Hey, Mikey. <laughs> All right, so it looks good. And uh, thanks for sharing oh, this. They won't see our TV. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Where is this thing? Oh, here it is. Okay, here's R2D2. Let me see if I can put him there. 
Uh oh, the camera's slow. There we go. Is R2D2? You can't stop walking. Said I had a peanut butter sandwich for dinner. Oh, yeah. So he's working. So he's driving. So that's not real exciting. Let me get a little closer. Dave shared it in the chat for the song. <laughs> oh, okay. Hang on. Let me hide that comment that way. Dreamy's here. Okay. So I got to get back to the. Thanks for sharing that song. Man. Yeah, that was interesting. There it is. You can barely see this. There we go. A little closer. Hold on. Sorry. I got the shaky hands there. But hey, there's R2D2. So somebody went crazy at the um, Hobby Lobby clearance. No, that was Comic Con. Oh, this was Comic Con? In a box. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, interesting. Mm -hmm. All right. So anyway, so let's let's do the reveal on the other pizza. But anyway, this one's pretty good. All right, so that's the uh, plane, and that looks great. Pizza cutter. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so now we're gonna. Oh, that's pink. Yeah, you can really see that. But this way, you should be able to see the pizza. Hopefully. Oh yeah, this is good, and it's hot. I'm gonna turn this off. Wow. Keep smiling. Keep shining. Oh, you can always count on me. There we go. So there's that one. Wow, that's hot. <laughs> it's like 400 degrees. It's terrible. <laughs> oh, you're lurking. Oh, look at that. So there, there it is. Let me put that on the plate. So that's it. That's the vegetarian. And this one has broccoli, tomato, uh, garlic. What am I missing? Oh, onion, garlic, onion. And a little bit of broccoli. So pretty healthy. So the bottom line is, try it. You guys can do this. And you see it. That took me two seconds. And um, and Darren, if you are if you hit the Dollar Tree, this is the pizza crust. You can make this yourself. And it takes two seconds. It's real thin. I don't know if you like thin, but anyway. Yes. Okay. Let's see what else. So we got Drini. Thank, welcome in, Drini. Uh, he loves Dion Warwick. Oh, you like Dion Warwick? <laughs> I do too. Yeah. Yeah. She has, she has great music, you know, uh, what's his name? Bert Bacharach. He just passed, right? Really? Yes, he I did. Think, I think he passed a while back. I don't know, but the, he was on the list. Like there was a list today that they were talking about. And, um, yeah, it was interesting. I went, Oh yeah. Bert Bacharach. Maybe he did a while back, but they were talking about mm -hmm. him, Tony Bennett and, Something Two others. I can't remember who the other one. Ago, maybe, I think. Yeah, I forget, I forget who the other one was. But I was like, oh man, like everyone's getting old. So anyway, mm -hmm. yes. And then Dory did it. Yes, please. Looking like veggie pizza. Yeah. Veggie garden pizza. Yummy. He, see, and that's not bad. And there it is. And this took two seconds. Like it's so thin. Like that that crust. I think if I had left it in any longer. Oh, Bert, Bert died back in February. It was February. Yeah, they were talking about him. They had him on the thing, and it was like Bert Bacharach, Tony Bennett. Oh, the guy, not Crosby. Crosby? ZZ top guys. Yeah, I think one of the ZZ Top guys. But there was one more. There were four people that died this year that were musicians. And I, don't, I can't remember who the fourth one was. But yeah, that's not bad. And you see how easy that was. Very, very easy. Yeah. So you see, so we did this in 54 minutes. That's pretty good. Yeah. But like I said, the, the main thing is you have to make the crust. You don't have to make the crust, but you know, that's a good, that's a good thing. You can buy the crust from the pizzeria, you know, and they make it usually from scratch or, you know, you can just use any of those recipes that you find. There's like a food network one. There's a, there's a bunch and those are real easy. And then I have a lot, I have a bunch of links in the chat. Um, so my rant that I was doing earlier this year, Oh, hey. There's a King Morgan. My rant earlier, oh, from the band. Oh, okay. I forget what his name was, but I saw four people. There was a, we were in Target and they had a People Magazine kind of musicians talking about the death, whatever the la the latest People Magazine was talking about, Tony Bennett, and then three other people. And I was like, oh, I didn't know those people passed away. So anyway, but yeah, this is not bad. See? Yeah, so this is good. And it's pretty easy. And if you guys have, you know, if you're cooking, not cooking, if you're growing, you know, if you have your own tomatoes and things like that in your garden, you can do that. Because onions are pretty easy to make, right? And I, actually, if you had some fresh basil, you can throw that on there. That's really good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we had some fresh basil, but then it died. <laughs> mm -hmm. So we killed it. And uh, be creative. Thanks for coming in. And you like the pizza cutter. 
cool. So, and then you had peanut butter. <laughs> well, we enjoy peanut butter. We eat that almost not every day, but we eat yeah, a lot. It's, yeah. it's, a, it's a lunchtime favorite of ours. Yeah, we eat that a lot. So, yeah. And then, hey, girl, hey. <laughs> Say hi to um, Sandrine. Good to see you. Yes. BJ said if we ever made a whole wheat pizza crust no we have not um yeah well uh, I, I, I have I don't, I don't so i have a, i have a i have a it depends so i would say um uh, see whole wheat flour is better for you but um the thing is it is it can be dry so i would say add a little i hate to say add water and more oil but like olive oil so this this uh pizza crust that i made had a little bit of olive oil in it and that might make it a little less dry, but I've noticed that whole wheat flour is very dry. Yeah, so let's see anybody else. I'm gonna make sure I didn't miss anybody. <laughs> and Dave and uh, John, I don't know what they're doing. <laughs> they're, saying, they're putting the band together. They're putting the band together. Yes, <laughs> and thanks, uh, Lydia. And uh, anyway, so check out uh, the members. And I hope John's was in there. Did you hit John's? Let me see. I'll check Nightbot real quick. Sure yeah, yeah. And then I have to add the new people. Mary so Michelle says she puts her pizza is going to be iron skillet with a little bit of olive oil and gives the pizza oh a nice pizza hut type of crust oh okay right. nice yeah that's see? good so i'll check let me just check my night but i have to add you the new members in so next time i'll definitely put you in yeah 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 so then we'll be good oh maybe before the summer's out i'll finally put in that pizza oven in the backyard yeah we're hoping that we're we're looking at pizza ovens i don't know why but we're doing that pizza ovens <laughs> and a uh, hibachi grill Yes, yes. Yeah, we're trying to see if we, you know, I don't know. Like, we, we've been seeing stuff on the Facebook uh, marketplace. marketplace. Thank you. We're trying to kick it up a notch. Trying to kick it up, but we'll see. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. It's crazy. Oh, yeah, we got John. Okay, good. We got Granny D. Yeah, yeah. Okay, we're good. Awesome. We got everybody. But we got to add the new ones. But next week, we'll we'll, we'll get you straight. Because that'll, that'll be some serious typing, which I might fail. <laughs> Let me go to the latest comments. But anyway. And if I missed anything, just uh, yell at me in the in the uh, chat. <laughs> so yeah, I like the cast iron. So anyway, oh, let's talk about this. I we, we were trying to have a little field trip today to the uh, what's that store? Not well, the um, the cooking store, and they're all closing. So anyway, <laughs> but um, last week we talked a little bit about the um, the, the coating. You know, you want to try to avoid the coatings in the non-stick pans uh, because they've had a lot of well anyway I, I put a link in there <laughs> that talks about you know some of the poisoning that happens with these uh mm -hmm. coatings and i would say if you can try to stick with the cast iron or the stainless steel pans and then that way you and then you know you don't have to deal with it with the uh because the coatings always get uh, ripped or they always rip out over time mm -hmm. yep so anyway let's go here so these are the members. Got Roberta. And try estate sales. Yes, that's right. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. Well, you know what's funny? I was a I was an estate sale junkie. Mm -hmm. And I had to stop. Yeah, because well, first of all, it's very time consuming. And um I but I've gotten some good stuff there. Yeah, for sure. So you can get a lot of good stuff there. Let's see, John saying I bought a 99 Ford Ranger off Facebook. <laughs> Okay. For thirty one hundred, that's not bad, uh -huh, yeah. and it runs like a darling. What? Yes. Now we do have we do have a convection oven. Like I do have I have a convection oven at, that has a hot dog roller on the top. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's so amazing. I love that thing. But anyway, mm -hmm. <laughs> but I got that from one of the shopping channels back in the day. Yeah. <laughs> and there's Daphne. Welcome in, Daphne's creative touch. And if uh, if you want to drop your link, just type Kelly in the chat, K E L L I, and it should drop you. But I think most of you have each other. Let's see. Please, everyone. Oh, okay. Thanks, John. Please, everyone, remember to hit the like button if you have not. Thank you. Nice. I need the hype. I need the hype man. <laughs> There's Melanie. And let's see. Public su public supermarkets used to sell fresh dough. I don't know if it still does. Yeah, that's that's the best way to do it if you can. But the Dollar Tree. If you if you ever go to the Dollar Tree, they have some great. Um, the pie crust was actually pretty good, and it's a dollar twenty-five, and it's and it's this is and this is the one here uh, that I used here, and um, you know that's perfect for like a big a big guy, you know, 
<laughs> you know, you have a couple meals out of that, right? Uh, I feel like Dave would probably roll that up into like a burrito. <laughs> well, Dave, you know, he's tall, very tall. Yes, you're a secondhand store junkie. Yeah, those are great. Yeah. Oh, she tells us what we bought with our new uh, Which one? discs. Oh, it's up to you. Yeah, go ahead. It's pizza night. Okay, cool. Now you got you count. I mean, I'm not sure. So which we one. bought. Uh, <laughs> yeah. We went to the Goodwill and actually found like a boatload of laser discs, old laser discs, movies oh. that between Disney. Yeah, we found some Disney ones, which was pretty good. Uh, found the original Superman, Fiddler on the Roof. Yeah. Uh, stir crazy just like yep. i think i have like 67 discs yep. right now yes and we just got our hands on a uh laser disc player which is yeah which is awesome yeah which is interesting now the um yeah so so john says he's been buying dvds vhs so he can stop paying for streaming mm -hmm. yeah it's interesting i think what's funny around here it's a shame you don't live closer because we went to a the flea market last oh, yeah, week geez. And this man had probably 5,000 <laughs> VHS, DVDs, all the above. I mean, he had so many movies. And I was like, that's crazy. I don't know what you do with all this stuff. One box of laser discs. I think I, by the time I counted them at home, it was like 17 laser discs. He was like, 10 bucks. Yeah, 10 bucks for 17 movies, which is pretty good. That's yeah. not bad. Yeah, it's not bad. But oh, Cauliflower Crust. Yeah, so that's a good. Oh, yeah. So I have I haven't done that yet. I've made although I've made cauliflower rice. Now have you, have you ever done that? That was actually really good. Um, so if you're trying to cut down on your carbs, cauliflower rice, and all you do is you take cauliflower, you you know you wash it obviously, and then you just take a grater and just grate it, and it cooks like rice. It's amazing. But yeah, cauliflower crust is probably decent. Yeah, I've never done that, but I may have to try that. Oh, see, so want some pizza? Don't, don't you say bye, y'all. <laughs> Some that's great out. you're out <laughs> thanks for coming yeah. <laughs> we'll see you later yeah <laughs> you yes. gotta let us know where'd you go yeah and was it good was it local was, was it, it local was it, a chain? was it a chain yes <laughs> these are the things we need to know yes so we're we're good all right so you know what i'm gonna do if you guys i'm gonna drop the link and if anybody wants to talk about more food we'll do it and then if not that's fine too but let's do that. I'll invite. Uh, We're done. I can't believe it. Like 20 minutes. Yeah, it took like no time. Yeah. I mean, we were done like a half an hour ago. We have used VHS, Blu-ray, DVD, records, cassettes. Oh, wow. Yeah, we have a lot of. Yeah, all that a stuff. A lot of uh, uh, records. Mm. Like we just probably got, what, two working uh, record players now? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And yep. DJ's the cauliflower crust recipe. I've seen a lot of eggs and cheese in it. Oh, is that how you do it? Yeah, I was wondering. Mm. Okay. Because I, yeah, I was wondering how you held it together or how, yeah, because cauliflower, mm. excuse me, usually they grate it or whatever. Yeah, can't stop. Yeah, laser discs. Yeah, that's some that's yeah. old school. That's the precursors of the DVD. Yeah, the, the thing was, um, one of my relatives, well, first of all, one of my relatives bought the first VCR and paid was it a thousand probably a thousand bucks or three thousand dollars for it and i just went oh we got somebody uh -oh, hold on <laughs> but probably Lydia. Yeah, but let's see let me see i have to see oh lord she said give her a minute She's okay a that might be oh i see okay hang on of course like i've got way too many things in here yeah and before oh that's john oh. hey john how are you <laughs> hang on just a second yep that's him and what was it? The, it was uh, Betamax and then VHS, or was it? Yeah, I think it was Betamax and then VHS was the final. Yes, Betamax was right hello, before. Hello, hello. How are you? Hey, Joe. How are you doing? Let's see. Can't hear him. Can you hear me? Let me see. He's in there somewhere. Let me see. But anyway, yeah. So we had yeah Betamax. Can you hear me? I didn't have Betamax, but yeah, we've been. Um, we had VHS, DVD, and we just now we got one. Laser disc, yeah. But anyway, one of my relatives had a laser disc, and he passed away, and I was like, oh, man. So anyway, I didn't have access to the laser disc. He had all these great movies. Yep. Let me see if I just can't hear. Can you see. hear me? Oh, there we go. Oh, better. Yes, yes. So can you turn it up just a little bit? Yeah, hold on. Yep. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I was scared because I was like, did I not hear him? But okay. Oh, hey. Can you hear me there now? You go. Yes, much better. How are yeah. you? 
Good. I, I, I see I have one of these like podcast mics. So I, I had a feeling you did. Yeah. And yeah, so whenever fancy. I make certain videos, I have to like, it's weird. You have to like fidget with the right volume amount for what you're trying yes. to do. Because yes. otherwise, when you're trying to make like a, a very thought provoking podcast and you're right. like, hey, how's it going? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, I understand. But that pizza looks amazing. Oh, thank you. Yeah, see, and this is, and so all I'm saying is to you guys, this is so easy. Like you saw, it took me like no time. It's just, you know, like I said, our my my, uh, it's it was so warm today. It's warm in our kitchen, so sometimes dough gets weird when uh, it gets really warm. But you know, it didn't take much time. I had to just keep adding back flour just to make it a little drier. <laughs> you know, I never would have thought 90 degrees would feel so good, but there we it's have. Okay. Two. We had yes. two weeks in July where it was a hundred mm. plus nonstop that's two weeks in a row. Okay. Wow. Wow. That's crazy. Oh, hey, Doretha. Good to see you. So, yeah. Oh. So I actually, we have a local uh, farmer's market we go to. Um, yeah. And uh, there's a lot of the stuff they grow in their own greenhouse. Mm -hmm. um, and then they have stuff that they bring up like the chilies from New Mexico because yeah. No matter what people say, they get there's food snobs, and I'm one of them. But yes. uh, but green chilies from New Mexico, the hatches are the best. Okay. But um, but so I roasted them on my barbecue, and then I put them in the the oven for a slow roast, and then I put them in the fridge, yes. and then you uh, take the skin off, and then you put it in like a food processor, and you know you can add other elements to it or you put it in a mm. freezer bag and then you can take elements. If you want to put it into a salsa, you can do it. If you want to put it into a chili, you can. Okay. That sounds so, really yeah. good. Yeah. Oh, Hey Lydia. Oh, Lydia's here too. Okay. Let me let Lydia come on up. Hello. Hello. Yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> Hello. Your pizza <laughs> oh, looks yummy. Oh, good. Yeah. Thank you. Yes. I decided, um, like we're trying to have everybody cook at home. At least, you know what I mean? So try this, try some of these tips at home. And there's so many, like Nana Michelle's a good, you know, she's a good info on the vet, the vegetarian or vegan stuff. And then, you know, my husband and I have really been trying to try like more fresh things. So, and I just go in the store and say, what looks good? Let's go with that. You know what I mean? And then we go, hey, yep. But it's good. Yep. But anyway, so that's it. But it's so it's so easy. So yep. Oh, butter. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, let's see. Let me see. What did see? Everyone's saying hello. Let's see. But anyway, welcome up, Lydia. So uh, what what are you gonna Thank have? Thank you. What are you having for dinner today? I had a uh, sandwich. Oh, sandwich. I had cheeseburger. Not very much, but. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, so John, what are you having today? Or have you had your meal today? Hi, butter. Oh, hi, butter. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I was like, what, I, what does that mean? <laughs> He's saying hi to uh, Doretha. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I'm reading the chat. It's really funny. But uh, yeah, that's really good. But anyway, John, thank you so much for gifting the membership. That's exciting. Oh, yeah, no problem. Sorry, I was... Uh, yes. I'm fixing something on my obs real quick <laughs> oh yeah no that's fine oh listen so anyway yeah if at some point if you want to if you want to join in and, and do you know an interview i've been interviewing any members who are brave enough to uh <laughs> come on up and chit chat yeah, anytime, just let me know you know well it's up to you because i i'm um uh, I'm, I'm free because <laughs> i know you have you have multiple projects you're working on um like other than the couple of times i live stream i'm usually pretty good you know, other than that, right? But yeah, so that's exciting. <laughs> okay. Oh, leftover pizza. Dory's having. And Dave's having New Zealand corned beef for dinner. What? Uh oh. Did I just fall out? Uh -oh. That sounds good. Oh, 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 it's the camera. Yeah, our camera dies after an hour. Oh, yeah. yeah it, it it sort of goes nope. <laughs> but anyway, but that's the pizza. <laughs> so I, what I'll do is I'll take it out. Yep. Oh, it's mm -hmm. back. Yeah, I'm like, oh, we still see it. Mm. I still see it. No, no, it, it, it just dipped out for a minute. But anyway, but that's it. We're just so excited. Yeah, we're so excited about the, the pizza. Mm -hmm. So I don't know, next week, I'm not sure what store. Somebody mentioned maybe um, one of the salads, like from, uh, 
what was the other one? It was Subway. They were talking about Subway. Mm-hmm. Do you guys eat Subway still? Uh, occasionally, but it it sometimes it can be really bad. Yeah, I oh, was. I, <laughs> it's one yeah, of those we, things that like yeah. talk, like a uh, pizza hut, like you guys were talking about, like back in the day. I, I don't know if, if if whether something happened, if we're like in some kind of like wormhole because of you know stuff or or if, but it's like everything tasted better in the nineties. I think so. Yeah. I think yeah. so. Yeah. And Subway was amazing in the 90s. I mean, it was great, you know. <laughs> but uh, speaking of which, by the way, this is what I had for breakfast, Kelly. Okay. Oh. At this local restaurant. Uh, okay. And it's called, a, they, call, they call it a biscuit supreme. Okay. Mm. So they do biscuits and then mm-hmm. uh, uh, eggs and um, scrambled eggs. And then they do ham. And then you get hash browns with it. Ooh, I, yummy. And then they oh, put wow. gravy and, and melt and put the cheese on it. And so, uh, wow, like uh, I eat that and like so I have I I don't had I don't need dinner because I I hate that this this morning and that's like my meal for the entire day. I would understand, yes, because gravy is no joke. <laughs> oh, I love gravy. Biscuits and it, gravy is awesome. Is <laughs> amazing. So it'll fill you up. <laughs> it will. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's cool. Let's see. We got uh, oh, so Dave likes tuna subs only from Subway. Mm-hmm. Lisa's hair. Lisa knits in vlogs. Good to see you. And then Regina's saying Subway's outrageous. Oh, the price. Remember, the, it used to be $5. Like, I don't know what they are now. Yeah, I bet they're much more than There's that. There's a lot more now. Yeah. How, how much? Do you know? I think seven, eight dollars $8. $8. So it's gone up. Yeah, that's quite a bit. Yeah, we, we haven't been there. Uh-oh. And then, <laughs> Dave, what are you eating? Strawberry biscuit at Popeyes. Nope. Should, should we have done him? Oh yeah, yeah. Did you you didn't did you hear our story earlier, Dave, about Popeyes? Well, we, I think <laughs> might have. I didn't say Popeyes specifically, but, but let's yes. just say what we're just gonna say. We're just gonna say yeah, Popeyes is not. <laughs> wink, wink. <laughs> right. <laughs> wink, wink. Uh, be careful with what you you know. Keep your eyes open over there. Yeah, we we went there a while back. So I'll I'll, I'll do the the abbreviate. It was just that this person. Oh, he missed it. Yeah, he missed it. Okay, so what what had happened? What had happened was um, we went to Popeyes and we were in line, and we were two or three behind, you know, in, in the back of the line. And some guy came up to the counter and he had he had his chicken. Oh, there goes the camera again. He had his chicken in his hand and he said. I didn't order this. And he kind of said, I didn't order this wing. I didn't order this thing, you know, and he just fingered all this food. And then he, he gave it back to the manager and the manager took the food back and threw it back on the shelf to, to serve to people. So they had both like felt up the food and then uh, put it back. So we well, were just like, are really oh, wow. Grody now. I mean, a lot of fast food places are grody it's, and they don't care. <laughs> you know, it just, it's, <laughs> um and i actually have a friend who used to work for you know they uh would go in there um i don't know if they have this company over here but uh basically what they would do is they would wash like towels and yes. all of your you know any kind of like your cooking aprons or anything like that so they did all that mm-hmm. fabric washing so they yep. would always come in and wash all the towels for the restaurant and the guy would come right. in and tell you he's like uh don't go to that outback here in town because- okay here we go. <laughs> That's but crazy. Those are the, 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 ro- the chilies I roasted. Wow. Yeah. So anyway, so they they just had bad workers, you know, and mm. um, so we were just like we walked out. Yeah, we walked out. So anyway, oh, so oh, yeah, okay, so you. um, oh, Lisa's saying a foot long is fifteen dollars. Wow. She says she's in Australia. Oh. Yeah, yeah. That's it's, why. it's almost that way here for us because it's like I think uh, yeah, thirteen or twelve bucks now. We oh my goodness. You get, if, you, if you get the bigger ones. Oh wow. The deluxe wow. one, like the chicken bacon ranch, or Woo. you know, Mara said she got the yeah, Mara's twelve dollars. Wow, that used to be five. <gasps> Dave said, finish you. <laughs> you and then you remember when the sad boy used to do like the five dollar daily one, like whatever yes. it was, and, and um, so they, they've done at least in ours, they've done away with that, yeah. Anyway, I guess I gotta get rid of the camera, he's dying. Yeah. Tell him the Froyo story. Oh, yeah, yeah. So there it is. So now it's back. Nope. Uh, ew, that's why I quit eating fast food. Yes. Yes. So really, so that's the other thing. So even though I hate to like gross you out, but like eating at home is better. Yeah. Because <laughs> at least I, you know, wash my hands, wash the food. You know, I really tried hard. 
Yeah, and that's it. That's very expensive, and it's not worth it. And you actually. know what you put in there too, though. I mean, and and yes. you'll never know what they put in there that might cause your allergies or cause your reactions mm-hmm. or. And then, True. of course, there's always cross contamination, which is always the biggest culprit in restaurants. Yes. Yep. And you know, given the time of day that we're living in, it's kind of like people go to work sick. Yeah. I'm like, it's no, stay home. Mm-hmm. You'll hear them coughing in the back, or I'm like, Mm-mm. yeah, it's not good. Nope. So that's nope. the chicken chili I made the other day. Oh, that was good. Oh, hold yeah. on, let me see. Yeah, if I can... Let me turn it. Over. Let me see. Uh oh, hold on. Bad fingers here. Yeah. Oh, that looks good. Let me take this down. Brother Ronald Joe said, "Remember the commercials for five five dollar foot long." That looks really good. It's probably gonna be like a twenty dollar. Yeah. Twenty dollar foot long. long. Yep, I remember those commercials. <laughs> but I, I, I slow cooked that, and so oh. I did a whole process where I did, Check I took onions, uh, hmm. bell peppers. Okay. Um. A little bit of jalapenos and then some green so i took some of that green chili and yes. then um i reduced it down you know i sweated it out you know with some a little okay. olive oil and and then i put in uh after i cooked the chicken because i always like to slow roast the chicken mm-hmm. and then put the chicken in there and then some tomatoes diced tomatoes oh wow um and then um white beans and a, one a couple of cans of white beans a can of pinto yes. beans yes and then of course the okay. your kind of seasoning you put you i always yes. put cumin chili powder mm. just a tad of paprika black pepper yep. okay. uh, a little bit of salt and <laughs> yeah and then uh, the other oh, thing wow. too is so i lighten it up because to me whenever i eat like chicken chili like i don't like like for us like w- a lot of people have chili they, they have like the red chili right yes so one of the things that i do that also offsets the the temperature of the of the peppers Mm-hmm. and also gives it kind of more of a neutral color is that I'll put in a can of condensed or evaporated milk. Oh, okay. Mm. Nice. Ah. Yes. And that's good for, um, and that's a good prepping thing to keep, you know, the, the evaporated milk. Oh, I, when I go to Sam's club, I'm always buying it. So I have like you know, here at the house. <laughs> you have a lot. Yeah. No, it's good. Oh, yeah, and that's, especially during this it. winter, when I get into soup season, I make my homemade uh, potato yes. soups. Yep. And my wife oh, hates really cream oh. potato soup. And she's like, you make the bomb potato soup. And I do. And one of the, okay. the big ingredients I put in it is leeks. <laughs> leeks are amazing. Leeks are delicious. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, so VJ said, I ordered a salad. The man took my money, then stuck his hand in the lettuce and started making my salad. I had to get his attention and told him, I do not want that salad. You handled money. There you go. Yep. And then Nana Michelle saying allergies and I need you to put on gloves. Yeah. See, people don't realize, you know, it's so important, but yeah. And then Nana Michelle saying that chili looks wonderful. <laughs> yeah, that does look yummy. It's like a two thumbs up, three thumbs up. We went to that yarn store and that chick had a mask on. Oh yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, I want you, to the yarn. I was like, uh... you sweated out the chicken. <laughs> oh my goodness. And let's see, and everyone's saying hi. Okay, Lisa's saying, I just got a salad on my foot long, and it costs between $12 and $15, depending on which su- suburb I go. Wow. That's a lot. Mm-mm-mm. Let's see. Did you see Dave's? Yeah, I'm, I'm going. I'm, I'm getting there. <laughs> <laughs> Dave is on the naughty chair again. Um, Evaporated milk with rice and sugar. With rice and sugar. Okay. And then Nana Michelle's like, ooh, did he even put on gloves? Gross VJ's crochet. Yeah, that's mm-hmm. not good. Everyone's saying hello. Hello. So anyway, yeah, that's terrible. I mean, so, you know, these are some of the reasons why we want you to, uh... oh, that looks good. <laughs> Is that chicken and um, like dumplings? Uh, no, actually, that's my homemade biscuits and gravy. Oh, biscuits. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. We, nice. And I put uh, chives and jalapenos on it. And... That looks yeah. yummy. Okay. <laughs> but, that, but that's actually homemade made from scratch. That's pretty like, good. I mean, like I made the, the biscuit, you know, mix and the, yeah. you know, with the baking soda and the, all right. The flour and all that. The flour and, and all homemade that. the okay. gravy and that's pretty good. All right. So, nice. Yeah. I love to cook. So. Okay. Perfect. I think that's why we're probably I love cooking and singing, so no wonder we're kidding. Okay, so we're good. So we're here. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. 
Yes, she sweated the chicken. Oh my goodness. And VJ said no. He's used he was using his bare hands. I was so happy I had not gone through the drive through. Yes. Yeah. People mm-hmm. just, that's another thing. You, you just don't know what you're getting into when you go through drive through. Yeah, because those people are hair they're mm-hmm. harried, you know, because of the stress of being in there. And Lord knows what's going on. Like you don't know. Let's see. I'm gonna have to oh, okay, with all this drooling. <laughs> yeah, Michelle's drooling. <laughs> Everyone's saying sweet bumpy biscuit. <laughs> I actually ran into a guy at Sam's Club today, and I was telling him because he was trying to uh, figure out how to make the best. Um, yes. <laughs> like, um, he was someone was trying to give him a recommendation of, oh well, you know, if you're gonna do some things with juices and natural gravies, get the whole uh, Chuck uh, roast beef. And I was yes. explaining to him yep. how that works, and the guy's just like, "You should do something on YouTube about that," because he's like, "I just don't know." <laughs> Let's tell him how to cut it, you know, because my dad right. used to be a butcher and, oh, okay. and used to work at a slaughterhouse. So he taught me how to c- cut meat. And it matters, especially beef. Yes. It matters how they cut the meat. Mm-hmm. And so that's another reason. If you go to a restaurant and you, uh, of course, you know, a lot of times the reason they're dry steaks is one, they're, they're usually frozen. And I, oh. so what I usually do is if I have frozen, uh, I'll, I'll, if I go get like, like today at Sam's Club, I got a bunch of steaks. For like you know for the for the next month or whatever mm-hmm. and um if i use something I'll like i'll have like a regular like steak dinner i'll yep. use that up within two days and then anything else if i freeze it i don't use that for like a steak dinner i'll use that in something like kebabs or i'll put it in something oh, okay. like um um like a like a saute or uh, a feed or something where you can add yep. elements uh mm-hmm. to, to to combat the dryness yes oh i love fajitas i haven't had those in a while yeah those oh, are great. Uh, yes. Out here we have lots of great Mexican restaurants. Yes, you do. Like yes, you're lucky. A place with oh, fajitas and oh, mm. margaritas and. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, welcome in, um, uh, Panama City. Good to see you. Saying hello. Yeah, that's a, you're driving. Okay, well, thanks for popping in and be safe. <laughs> but well, you know, thanks for uh, uh, working and lurking, as they say. Yeah, that's great. Well, you're doing well, John. So, so yeah, I need to, we need to come over there. <laughs> Apparently, like we're inviting her. Oh, okay, okay, he's killing me here. Oh no, what is this? Dude, John? that looks good. <laughs> that looks good too. <laughs> it's a homemade salad I make. It's a salad, but look okay. how pretty. Like it's the colors and everything. Okay. Yep. Oh, okay, yeah, it'll be in a second. But the cucumber. Okay. Yep. Yeah. And Those tomatoes look good. and red mm-hmm. onions and. Yep, put a little put a little cheddar. I don't know if that's cheddar yep. cheese or it's Colby. cheddar. Yep, yep, yep. It's yep. cheddar. Okay. Yep. Nice. And then nice. it's a mixture of greens and ice. Mm-hmm. And so I, so not only am I, 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 I love cooking, but I love making. I, I love taking pictures of my food. Mm-hmm. <laughs> we need and to I do think that like, more. That's a good artwork, you know, of how you can present it, right? Because it's yes. all about how no, you it's perfect. It play, play it and all that. But... It's perfect. Oh. <laughs> Dave what? says, let's have an, off, an online cook-off. I know, right? Have an online cook-off. <laughs> it's kind of tough considering the judge isn't going to... Yeah, no, we can't taste it. Yeah. yeah, yeah that's no. okay. But yeah. The, Looks the, good. It's just best picture. <laughs> that's what I'm going to do, best yeah. picture. Yeah, best that's... presentation. Best presentation. Yeah, I mean, that's really what it is. Yeah, that's cute. And then let's see. Everyone's saying, yum again. I know. Joy, he's torturing me. With all this good food. <laughs> No, that's awesome. And, and the point good. is to, to underscore what you've been saying all night, mm-hmm. which is do with this at home. Yes. It's yes. cheaper. <laughs> you don't have to worry about someone spitting in it or someone touching it. We just went to the bathroom mm-hmm. or, yeah. oh, you yes. know. <laughs> Who had a bad day and took it out on your food? Exactly. And and, and the, the key thing, too, is make your food with love. Like, like yes, I, I, I met absolutely. some people uh, in, in college and they were, they were cooks. Like these, these, these random people were cooks and every now and again, like, you know, they would say, I'd say, Hey, what'd you put in that thing? And they were like, I cooked it with love. And I'm like, <laughs> first I was like, like, <laughs> but I think there's something to that now. Like I didn't, at the time I was kind of like, yeah, yeah, whatever. You're trying to be funny, but you definitely, when you take time and care and thought, you know, you're meditating on the food. Like you want to, oh, okay. Really? <laughs> now that looks good. Okay. That looks good. I so know. this is what my, my, my wife made for me the other day. It's oh, 
because we have the, I was telling you about those world famous peaches that we have. Yeah, I see them. They're amazing peaches. Yes. And so it's homemade peach cobbler. <gasps> and then oh uh, that's Tillamook vanilla ice cream, French yes. vanilla ice cream. Looks good. So. All right. Now I want, <laughs> see, I was thinking about cobbler, ironically. Now I'll, I'll tell you a bad one. I mean, a good, but a bad one is, um, yeah. you, and I hate going to Walmart, but I, I do love Patty LaBelle's cobblers. Oh, yeah. She's got um, like a mixed berry and then a peach and then a peach apple or something. There may be one more, but I like them all. We've had them all. And you have to heat them a little bit. But if you heat them a little mm. bit, they're really good. Right. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, Patty I love peach cobbler. <laughs> yeah. That, that looks awesome. <laughs> That's what Nana Michelle, she said exactly that. I love peach cobbler. I, I, all it, all it right. It's amazing. Well, we do have a couple of peaches in there. I may have to do that later. Ice cream. <laughs> Regina. <laughs> yeah. Of course. Oh, not on <laughs> I could have went all day without seeing that. Yeah, I know. Because then you the, start thinking about ice cream. Put John on the list. <laughs> and then <laughs> and then Joy's drooling. Some drooling going on there. Michelle's drooling. <laughs> Regina said I could have gone all day without seeing that. Yes. It. Uh, is that whipped cream or is that the ice cream? That was ice cream. Okay. Yeah, that looks really good. Yeah. All right. So you're like killing me. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> close all night. I know. I know. We we have a we have a dairy not that far. So some days we're like, oh, should we go over there? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I uh, had, and my last oh, one. Yes. This one I oh, actually I put a lot of work into this one, and I did this. Oh, uh, for my wife on our anniversary, but okay, let me see. Oh, okay, really? <laughs> so, Nana Michelle, I too am lactose intolerant. Yummy, I suffer for what I love. Yeah, I know he suffers. That is delicious. You got the what is that, Mr. Moseman? You got to tell us. <laughs> so, it is a it is a white, it is a it is a mixture of white and velvet cake okay, with uh, <laughs> cream cheese. And uh, He's killing me. Look at fondant, this. <laughs> and then some raspberries, fondant. and then a raspberry puree jam type thing. That's crazy. For syrup. All so. right. Well. Did you go to cooking school by chance? I know. I'm like. Nope. I learned everything either from my dad or from uh, just try, trying things out. Okay. Was your dad so. a cook? My no, dad knows didn't. how to cook. Oh, my dad taught me he all the big he... basics of stuff. Okay. Yeah, he's doing well. Wow, that's really that's good. Cool. So he should be in a restaurant or something. Yes, yes. So uh, Dory's saying it, it's the care, love mm -hmm. for anything you, you share with others that makes stuff better. That's correct. In a Simone Watchman's taken. Oh yeah, that took me a while to do that and to get that just oh, right. I, I, I know, just, like, you, that's a lot of work. I can already and, tell. And my wife will still hear me cussing in the kitchen. And she's like, "What?" And I said, it's, "I wanted it perfect." <laughs> and pink waving. Yes, <laughs> that is crazy. Yes, so that's good. Okay, so we have to have that. No, and and she said, "Okay, one more time. Can you tell us what that is, John?" So it's a it's a mix of white and uh, uh, velvet white velvet cake, uh, mm -hmm. velvet cake type of thing, and then it had uh, yeah. Uh, I, I put uh, a cream cheese frosting. I got some fondant, and then I uh, to make the piece with the on really? the top, and then I did raspberries. Yes, and then I made a raspberry like syrup type thing mm, he drizzled that over yeah mm -hmm. yeah mm -hmm. so, so it's kind of like uh, my, it was like a, it was like kind of like a deconstructed like cheesecake type of thing yes uh, yeah, but yeah. it was but it was with a uh, velvet cake and yeah you know, so so panama city's waving at you hand pink <laughs> waving don't spill my water <laughs> okay. Hello. and then then michelle saying oh we're getting fancy now yes we are no apparently. apparently yeah we're not Maybe. But John is getting fancy. <laughs> Dave called it food porn. Food, uh, food porn. Yeah. <laughs> we're we're going to get some copyright strikes and some uh... and some uh, a little extra. But anyway, and then uh, Joy saying, "Where do you live, John?" <laughs> I live in Colorado. Colorado. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. Too far. Darn it. We can't That's like walk the over there. Yeah, it's going to be long. And then um, Lisa, good night. Thanks for coming. Appreciate you. Yeah, you you sleep well. All right. Yeah, Lisa's in Australia. Oh wow. Yeah. It's Saturday over there. It's Saturday. <laughs> it is. Happy Saturday. It's coming from the, uh, the future. future. Yes. Okay. There we go. Good night, Lisa. Yes. 
All right. Well, thank you so much for coming. That that is okay. You win. Like yeah, yeah. You, <laughs> we just had pizza. We're, we're pizza. Look, like, yummy. Been, I mean, it yeah. was good. You know, but like this. Yeah, he's like I don't know. <laughs> I read a few books too along the way. Of course, you can tell I love books. You have a few, yes. I have a few, and that's like Mm -hmm. not in counting like six or seven tubs and boxes I have on the side. Yeah, we have a lot of books. Somebody has a lot of books. I have a lot of books, but yeah, yeah, Yeah. (laughs) especially Star Wars books. Oh, I do too. I love especially the Timothy Zahn ones. Yes, the what? The Timothy Zahn books, the Star Wars. Okay, books, yeah, like, I do have like, like the heir to the empire and yeah, oh yeah. He didn't write the uh, Ahsoka one, right? No, he didn't. Not to my knowledge. Mm-hmm. That might have been. I don't know if that might have been Anderson or not, but because uh, I'm trying to remember if who wrote because there was the Legends, yep. then there was the then they actually did, I got the young I just got the Young Jedi series. Yep. Okay, and that was like by dumb luck at a Jubilee, like a one of those uh, Christian thrift stores. Yeah, someone just unloaded their entire series. And I'm like, oh, oh yeah, I I had that too. Somebody donated books, and I had all they had all the hardback covers of the oh. entire Wheel of Time series. And I was like, oh, oh, that's oh. awesome! Yeah, I love Wheel of Time and Lord <laughs> of the cool. Rings. I have a bunch of yeah, books on Tolkien and Lo- yes. Lord of the Rings. Like that whole yeah. like half of that whole mm-hmm. part right there is all about Tolkien yep. or Lord of the Rings. And yeah, the one I want to try and get my hands on is the uh, the Witcher series. Oh yes, yes, yeah, yep. Yeah. That's cool. Well, that is awesome. Let, uh, let's spread this out here. That way, here we yeah, go. there you go. Yeah, <laughs> there you go. And we, 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 the camera's gone, which is good. We're all fitting. We're all fitting. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, yeah, That's but I do great. like the Timothy Zahn series because they had, they had that, those. Those are the ones that they introduced. Uh, yeah. Um. Uh, uh, what's his name? My brain, Braun. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, and then I do like the Jedi Academy ones. Oh mm-hmm. yeah, by uh, Anderson. I haven't gotten them read those all ones yet. or not. I've been, I've been like hitting every thrift store just to see if I can find them, and mm-hmm. little yeah. by little. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, they're. Sometimes we see them. Okay, see you, Lisa. Good to see you. Thanks for yeah, coming. Like, like I said, last one I got is uh, Ollie's. Uh, yeah. The Alphabet Squadron. Yeah. You you can just you can just see that I mean I just I just have tons of fantasy books. Oh wow! Okay. Um, and everything by Stephen Donaldson. Oh, um, hmm. cool. You know I I have almost everything by Terry Goodkind. Hmm. I was I was the guy that would would take my lunch in the library and read. <laughs> oh, one of those. Yeah. <laughs> I can't say I've ever done that. (laughs) (laughs) I was out running around like a crazy person like everybody else. Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, and the other reason I love the library, because when I was when I graduated high school, uh, Mm -hmm. that's like right when the like, like we had the Internet and you could you remember the uh, what was it? The uh, when Apple did the trailers. And I can remember because it was like the quick play or real player or whatever. Oh, yes, yes. And you had to download the player and then you could watch the trailers from on Apple's website. But I can remember like watching the trailer for um, uh, for Phantom Menace, and you, you'd play it and it go right, yeah, 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 yeah. And, yep, yep. <laughs> yeah. Yep. and you, uh, so we'd watch that first part, like all of us, these bunch of Star Wars geeks, would just be like, like every three, oh, did you see that? Did you see that? you know? And then, <laughs> and then finally, after again. like five minutes, of course, kids yeah. these days will never understand the pain of uh, dial How up. How slow? Yeah, <laughs> very slow. But That's eventually, right. you get to that point, and it's just kind of like, <gasps> you know. And we just, and once you got it completely buffered in, you could watch it many times. And so, right. But... Yeah, those were that was terrible. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can that remember doing true. the same thing too. Um, uh, on my office computer, uh, for the first. The Fellowship of the Ring, the Lord of the Rings, and I just like, mm-hmm. and I watched that trailer so many times. I mm. got, I, I had remember the Burger King toys where they had like Elrond and you, you shall be the Fellowship of the Ring, and then they had like Boromir, you carry the fate of us all, little one. And I, I just would keep on going around everywhere, and I just played the little. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. You guys that's are a my big, nerdier than that's me. My, that's yeah. my big nerd. My big fandom. It, it is. is. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> that's okay. Yeah. No, that's funny. Don't feel bad. I'm still collecting figures for Star Wars, so. Yeah. I like your Transformer shirt there, too. Oh, thank you. That's another series I'm still collecting, like recapturing my... <laughs> Kelly my... shaking her head. <laughs> Help me. <laughs> she collects yarn. I got vintage toys. Mm. It is yeah. what it is. So, Lydia, what are you working on today? My scar. Okay. So, now, how far did you get since I saw you last? Um, I felt this much. Yeah, that's pretty good. Okay, I'm going to make you big real quick. Let me see if I can get you. Let's solo real quick. Hopefully, this will work. Slow. There we go. There's Lydia. That's nice. Yes. Oh, yeah, Dave. That's Dave has a good tip. Yes. Okay, thank you Yeah, for, sh for sharing that. Yes, we got some yarn You're people. welcome. Yeah. Also, anyway, this so Dave is saying, um, check out the Shop Goodwill Online bookstore. They scanned it all online. It's an online catalog that you can uh, ship. They'll ship it to you. Oh, okay. Yes. Yeah, because he used to do that. He used to put the stuff online for them. Yeah, I, I had to make yeah. all my uh, my list and put it on my Google Drive, so I'm not buying. Because I was buying repeats that I thought I had. I didn't mm -hmm, have. Mm -hmm. So I got probably hardbacks and uh, yeah. paperbacks. Oh. Soup. Soup. Oh, that's, your, that's your, hold on, let me see. Let me make you big. Do it this way. Solo. Nice. That's a fancy book. Yeah. That well, is cool. When you okay. say like, oh, would you learn some of that? Oh, that's kind of some of the places I learned stuff. Yeah, that's and good. And then I experiment and All right. always got to find things to experiment. But I've right. got books on this and stocking up and jarring. Mm -hmm. and... Yeah. So I'm like, I'm like the person, like if, if, if we're at the end of the world, I'll be like the library. I'm in the small town and, and like there's yeah. like only maybe about a hundred or so that live in this small town and we're closer to a bigger town it's about 15 miles, oh, okay. miles away but uh mm -hmm. i always joke with my wife that i could open up the town library you could <laughs> so, <laughs> that's pretty cool but uh <laughs> one of my favorites is have you ever had uh favorite uh -oh, bean hold and on. Rice? I, I just took you small let me put oh, you back good? hold on Th that looks good oh wow yeah. hold on so, so though, wait a minute let me make you big again fava bean and rice oh it's good stuff mm, oh, that, that looks yummy, yummy. Oh. Fava beans. Wow. Yeah, so. That's good for you. Yeah. So, yeah. So, there's a lot of good stuff on there. And Ooh. I just. Nice. You know, gumbos and beef Shirts noodle. and <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, fava beans. That's right. And a nice Chianti. And I've nice... never saw this before. I told my wife because she loves she mm. loves beets. Yes. And so, mm. it's a See, beet I don't know what to do with ravioli. it. Yeah, that looks actually pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. Ah. And so this is a book that guess what I found? I found it at a secondhand store. Okay. Oh, yeah. Mm, excuse me. <laughs> someone someone originally bought it for eight bucks at a Barnes and Noble on like a you know sale yep. or something, Barney, and then I just bought Barney's it for, bin. Yeah, for thirty five nice. cents at the secondhand store. That's awesome. That's really good. I like it. Yeah. yeah. So I mean, we've been doing a little bit of like I said, trying to find a little you know saving money the best you can. Um, yeah. Trying to do some uh, food shopping and things like that. Um, but anyway, I, I, I put a little shopping trip as a video, but I'm, I'm going to just put it. I'll put the link in the description. I was going to run a little bit today, but I think I'm not going to show you. But I've been just trying <laughs> to like, give people just some ideas. You know, go to your farmer's market. Go to your, uh, mm -hmm. uh, you know, your local, you know, smaller supermarkets and things like that. Because usually they have some kind of relationship with the local people. You can always right. get some good fresh stuff, yeah. That way. Oh yeah, because the, the the fresher the better. I mean, it's just it's mm -hmm. you know you yep. can't you just can't beat that and yeah. Um, like for example, this is uh, oh wow. Uh, yeah, that's, where, that's the place where I bought the chilies at. And so, okay, so, hold on. We got to. Oh, that looks really good. Wow, only, that is oh, a lot of peppers. Yes. Oh, hey, Ursula. Oh, those look really good. Wow. Oh, so, thanks yeah. for coming. Oh, it's 145. Ooh. Wow. Wow, wow. Yes, that those look delicious. 
Yeah. So, and they have all kinds of different peppers and, you know, that's at the local mm -hmm. market. And mm -hmm. I love, cause they actually have a, 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 on one of the walls, pictures of everyone that works on their farm and grows this stuff that. Oh, that's you know, nice. That's cool. And it, yeah. it gives you an idea that that's the person you're, 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 you know, you're connecting and you're supporting these local people and these families. Yes. 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 And I oh. totally, I'm totally for that, you know. Hmm. Yeah, so Panama City you. likes that. And thanks for coming in, Ursula. Oh, I'm Granny Square. And then yep. here we go. <clears throat> Let's see, Let me see what else you have there. So then that was, the, so those were the peaches and then the corn, the sweet corn I was telling you about. Oh, my goodness. So, <laughs> that looks good, too. <laughs> so I, so we over go in there. My wife just, she just goes, can I just work here? Can I just like yes. put my, op, my computer and just sit in this? Because uh, it's like a walk-in fr uh, freezer, fridge type thing, you know? Oh, yes, yes. And uh, wow, but so yeah, just, wow, it's... those peaches look good, they yeah. Look really and they're good. like I said, they're all done, it's all local. And yep. at Palisade, oh wow, the town's about 25 miles from 20 miles mm -hmm. from here, so it's yep. they've got really good. Hi, Ursula. Yes, everyone's saying hi. You can't sleep. Oh, yeah, I hope you rest well. Yeah, yes. that's that's terrible. And there's Rosalie James, thanks for coming in. And uh, anyway, but thank you all so much for coming in. And, and like I said, I like to talk about food <laughs> and, mm -hmm. and healthy food. But anyway, good to see you. Thank you so much. And other stuff. And other stuff. <laughs> 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 and John, you know, if you want to rewind, Rosalie, John got some had some beautiful food items he prepared. So he, <laughs> yep. he's, I think he's winning the cooking show challenge the there. Cook, <laughs> I, I, well, maybe, possibly. <laughs> I think you, I think you, you yeah. I think you are. Yeah, because we we've been working on a pizza today, so that's not real exciting, but you know it is what it is. <laughs> <laughs> it's still good. I mean, it's that's... okay. Yeah, it's okay. So yeah. that's great. No, I really appreciate. It. Let me let me separate us here again. But there you we go. know, and so and that mm -hmm. gives you kind of too this just all the different kinds of mm -hmm. um, oh look at that they have. You go in there and <laughs> hold on. It's, 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 Gotta make you big. Keep teasing us. <laughs> Wow! Yeah, those look great. Wow! Yeah, they look delicious, but it look like it might hurt you. It might hurt you a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> That's why but you yeah. put it in food and you you dial it down with something else. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you have to. But yeah, those and yeah, those big gym, yeah. those big gym yeah, peppers Dory. are just so good. And then yeah, but yeah. So, but this place is just awesome, and and uh, it's just great to have a local. Mm -hmm farmer's market and you know there's so many different farms in the area yep so just i love living in such an agricultural area you know yeah like that's it's, beautiful it's a blessing it really it mm, is a blessing yeah, it you is. know it's like, that really uh, is a blessing absolutely yeah, we, we, we have a a blast going to our places yeah we we try to you know that's what sort of like started us because i swear i don't think i was really thinking about the food that much you no, know prior we, to that i mean we, we were getting we were eating okay but I, like I, I grew up in the city so that was yeah. not the norm outside of a supermarket yeah yeah and um but you know they've gotten better with their food you know down there let's see nana michelle saying yeah had some <laughs> yes john had some bougie foods <laughs> 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 but kelly your food is family delish and we love it oh thank you <laughs> very kind yeah it's a uh... you gotta get that chef's hat john just like oh, yeah I yeah I think... okay now, now really oh there's these so <laughs> <laughs> so that's a picture i take so of a flower that's the colorado state flower the columbine yes okay okay oh the columbine so, yeah. yeah that's the that's the flower of uh yep. colorado right yep yep, yep it is it's state very flower. pretty yep. state yep. flower yeah so yeah that, so photography is something i like to do as well you know okay so mm -hmm. john's fancy mm -hmm. <laughs> you're doing great very artistic that's good. So let's see. Oh, so Ursula said she thought they were bananas. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but then she said, oops, but when I looked closer, they weren't. Banana yeah. peppers. <laughs> Banana peppers, they call Probably. Them. Probably. Yeah, right? Yeah. Yeah. So anyway, so that's good. Yeah, I mean, we, we really tried hard to, like I said, do the best we can, you know, and that's what I always say uh, to everybody, you know, just really just, I, this is like, I call, I call this like my food for thought. Um, just spend a little extra time trying to find those nice, like basically eat what you want, but try to get as fresh as you can, you know? Yeah. Yeah. And uh, that's the best, you know, that's the best for you. And I, like I said, I have all these links in the chat. If you want to look at the nutrition, I have the USDA um, website in there. 
I have, um, there's a, there's a little thing about a uh, high fructose corn syrup. I, I hate it. And they put it in a lot of foods. So try they to do. avoid that. They do. Yeah. Avoid it if you can, you, you know, can't escape it, though. it's hard. We've really tried. It's really Unless hard. It is. Going yeah. out. <laughs> That's why yeah. if you can make it, you know, and you can find either yep. like to me, uh, I think molasses is much better for you. Yes. And I think it has a better taste as well. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Um, you know, or, um, Cause that's always the, it's kind of the thing. Like I, like I was telling someone like, um, cause I, I love like waffles and pancakes and, and French too. toast. <laughs> I French do too. Toast. I love French yes. toast. Yes. And yeah, you we get love that all syrup and bad. you realize that a lot of that maple syrup is based off of corn syrup. Yes. You know, it's maple flavored corn syrup is what it's, I call it's it. It's exactly what it is. Yep. So I actually made it a homemade um, maple syrup using molasses and then oh, using okay. um, uh, vanilla and uh, maple extract and then putting in some cinnamon and some other stuff. And it... All right. So we're going to do that next week. I think that sounds like a plan. <laughs> next week's going to be breakfast. It's going to be breakfast. Breakfast with John. <laughs> and with breakfast with John. <laughs> yep. Uh, I that do love breakfast. Good. That's my favorite. That's the, that's the best kind of food to eat during oh. the day. Hey, Mara. Yeah. See you, Mara. Thanks for coming. See you, Mara. Hey, yep, that's awesome. And uh oh, can't okay. I gotta read this correctly. Can't stop walking, but love mowing and cruising. Hey, <laughs> he's very happy. So, did you enjoy the pizza? Yeah, he did. I think. Yes. <laughs> and uh, yep, everyone's saying hi. Okay, but that's awesome. So that's where we are. Um, so anyway, the pizza. I can't really show it because my other camera died. But here, here it is. Just be careful. <laughs> There it is. A little um, close. Uh, there we go. Bam. That's the vegetarian pizza. That looks yummy. <laughs> it does. It does indeed. It came out really well. And uh, like I said, I just bought, good. Yeah, I bought the broccoli. You know, that look, That was the best looking vegetable, I think, that week. And then the cherry tomatoes or the grape tomatoes. Those were good. And then just the onions. And we like red. I like red onions on pizza. But we have um, white onions. We have yep. uh, all the above. The the green ones, you know, the uh, scallions and things yes. like that. Like we buy them all. Especially for the, uh, They're so good. The omelets. Yeah, for omelets and things like that. Yep, that's what we do. Yes. Yeah, it's so good. And I made my own crust. So this is the Dollar Tree pizza shell. So you guys check, try it. It's really good. Dollar Tree. Yeah. And it comes hanging in a little bag. And they usually put it on an end cap. So, yeah, it's pretty good. We, we like it. Yes. <laughs> yes. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> Arisla said it looks good. Yeah, it's not bad. And I just use fresh cheese as much mm -hmm. as I could and things like that. Oh, you like it? Okay, Gary likes it. Yeah. So, you know, I just challenge you guys. Give it a try. And, it, and you saw it took like five minutes. Like, it didn't take long. There it is. It's back. Oh, <laughs> the camera's back. Oh, oh his pizza. <laughs> okay, that, okay, John's making us look bad. Is that an everything pizza in there? Let's see what Pretty you got much. here. Yeah, that's yeah. And everything. Let me see. Let me slowly you here. Let's see. It's gonna be like where's Waldo? Let's see what we can spot. Let's go yes. black, some black olives. Some yeah, I see black olives, onions. onions. Yep. Uh oh. Is that uh I don't know if those are if that's pepper or green onions. Those are green those are those are uh green peppers. Green, green peppers. peppers. Okay, right. so yeah. peppers, yep. And then I can't tell what kind of is that meat? Oh, yeah, there's sausage and pepperoni. Sausage. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So sausage. So it's basically like a supreme pizza. It's like a yeah, supreme. Yeah. Okay. So see, John's being fancy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's like what? No mushrooms in there? Surprise. Um. Well, I I I did have me. mushrooms on there. Um, you can see it right there. Right here. There's one. Oh there. yes, <laughs> yeah. There's one. There's <laughs> I I had to kind of put it on one side of the pizza because my wife hates mushrooms and I. Absolutely I understand love, that. I love I love mushrooms. Yeah. And I and I had to like, I had to try to scarf down as or you know scrape off as many black olives because I'm not a big fan of black olives. Well, I really love me some black olives. They don't have a taste. I think they're bland. Like well, that's you know yeah. I probably think it's probably more of like a psychotraumatic thing from being a kid and not having my mom like make me eat black olives and they didn't like it. Oh, okay. associated with being yeah. You know when you're four. But I, I do have a usually have a theory about a lot of stuff, which is that if you don't like something, it's either because it was never prepared right or, um, you know, yeah, or it, it was or it was not um, 
uh, cut right or there it wasn't yes. it was either not you know cooked or prepared right. So it's like that is true. I'll, I'll tell you what I didn't like mushrooms for the longest time, and then some yep. an old friend's wife made a shiitake mushrooms. Oh my gosh, they're so good. They oh. are. <laughs> they <laughs> are so good. Yes, you like yeah. Them. She okay. made shiitake and portable, and she kind of made like um. It was kind of like a, I want to say it was like a casserole, but it was kind of like a, like a layered dish thing. Yeah. Yeah. And you can use those for, uh, well, portobello are good as a sandwich, sort of like a hamburger yeah. kind of thing. Yes. Oh, okay. Good night, Isela. Good to see you. Thanks for coming in. Good night. But yeah, um, Joy likes both pizzas. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, thank you. Now, I didn't make oh. this pizza, but uh, this is one of my favorite ones, which is the the flying buffalo pizza at Boston. Oh, nice. It's basically okay. chicken with buffalo sauce on it. <laughs> that looks really good. Wow. So okay. they don't put tomato sauce on it. They just put the they put the cheese and then they put uh, the that looks really olive good. oil and buffalo wow. sauce on it. Okay. Oh, thanks so again. Oh, so, yeah, I gotta say I gotta say thank you to Carrie oh, yeah. for rejoining. Thank you so much for coming back. Hopefully, uh, we can we have to we have to get you you know if you want to interview also. So thank you so much. Yes, so I'll, I'll I'll give you my my uh, members. This isn't my member. This isn't even my song. But here it is. <laughs> my husband's laughing. He's and he's gone. <laughs> he's gone. He's gone. Okay. Here, he's running. He's okay. like. <laughs> it's like right. the version of Hollow Oates. She's gone, but it's he's gone. He's gone. <laughs> oh, why? They're from Philadelphia too. Anyway, okay. Uh, <laughs> keep smiling. Keep shining, knowing you can always count on me. For sure, that's what friends are for. <laughs> In good times and bad times, I'll be on your side forevermore. That's what friends are for. All right. <laughs> Thank you, <laughs> Carrie. So anyway, you're here. Yep. <laughs> no, she. Oh, she thought I ended. No, we're here. I might be frozen, maybe. No, you're not frozen on my end. Okay, so I might be it's okay. Good. Nope, yeah, we're still here. No, we're still what, here. Well, it's eight. It's almost eight o'clock. So. Oh, it's almost eight. Oh, okay. Yeah. Let's see. Oh, there's John. Okay, hold on. Oh, Mama Jade. <laughs> Mama Jade, Mama welcome Jay. in. Hey, Kelly, baby, and, and yep. chat. Yeah, Hi, Mama saw... Jade. Mama Jay, good to see you. So, John, what else you have there? Uh oh. Oh, That's he's from hibachi. a local hibachi grill place, and I love <laughs> hibachi <laughs> grills because they cook perfect. it in front of you. Yes, that's, we <laughs> they love. They bring that. it out and cook it in front of you, which is always nice. We love that. That is our favorite. We're gonna be doing that one outside. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see how that goes. Yes, <laughs> we like that. We enjoy. So you have the volcano. I see. I see the yeah, onion volcano. Thing. They do it hibachi grills, you know. Yes. Or the steam train. <laughs> they do the steam train with the onions sometimes. Yes. They put the water and it streams. It goes choo choo choo. <laughs> <laughs> see the see the onion. Yep. That's a good. That's a good picture. That's a really good. That's picture. a really good picture. Yes. All right. So here's my question for you, John. Mm -hmm. You know when they use take yes. out that little dude to go and put out the fire? Don't tell it. Don't... <laughs> don't... Yes. Yes. It's like, don't you feel like they should have something other than that? Oh yeah. Thank you. Yes. 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 <laughs> it's just kind of weird. That's just my it opinion. Is. Anything yeah. else <laughs> would have sufficed, but that they have something kind of gross. Yeah. yeah. It's kind of weird. Yeah. I mean, it's supposed to be cute, but it's weird. It's not. It's not. Yeah. It's inappropriate. Yeah, it's not. It's not. It, it, and again, it goes just goes back to the, the point of just saying, uh, uh, I oh, don't okay. want to think about doing that bodily function while I'm eating. Yes. Yeah. yeah. I'm just kind of like. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, I understand. But, oh yeah, I forgot. Yes. 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 But anyway, let me see. There we go. Yeah, we're back. Okay. Oh, okay, I got you, Carrie. I got you, Carrie. Yeah, see, I'm all... Yeah. <laughs> I never even noticed. See, that's the thing. Like, I never noticed. Yeah, but thanks for coming back. Um. Yeah, and thank you. All right, so Rosalie's giving some hearts. We have a blue heart. And oh, Okay, John, you're killing me. Look at this. <laughs> what is like, that? So like uh, at the beginning of the year, we went down to Arizona, and you have to... Yes. From where we're at, you have to drive through the, Na the Navajo Reservation. Oh, so wow. the only place I would recommend eating on the Navajo Reservation is this place. Uh, it's a it's a hotel and museum and what, but this is authentic Navajo fried bread. Fried bread, oh, okay. yes, I've seen them make this on TV somewhere. Yes, that looks good too. And it's oh, phenomenal. Yummy. 
Where's David? I'm surprised he's not. Where's Dave? There. Yeah, he's, Dave. Pro- he's probably he's probably on the he's phone. Working. I'm like, he's working. He's on the phone or something. Fried bread, man. This is you. <laughs> All you brother. David's like, put the fire out with what? <laughs> we'll tell you. Oh, oh, we'll oh. tell you sometime <laughs> off stream, buddy. <laughs> well, well, yeah, we'll tell you. Yeah, it's something really inappropriate. And they and they laugh and they're like enjoying it and we're, and we're just going ooh. <laughs> and, and there's always little kids around and they're, you know. Hey Tina, <laughs> good to see you. It's just weird to be. I'm just hi like, Tina. And there's Shantyreman. Hey, good to see you. She's saying hi. Yeah. So anyway, hey. okay. So so John Moseman is showing us his delicious food. Now what is this, John? <laughs> In and out burger. <laughs> In and out. In and out burger. Okay. Yeah. No, we do not. Mm-hmm. No. That's like out west. They don't have it on your side of the country. We do not. No. We don't have that in my area either. Mm-mm. We got Shake Shack. Shake Shack. Yeah. Oh wow, that looks really, oh. really <laughs> cheesy. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> it's like I can feel my um, arteries. I, my arteries are I do think Five Guys is better, but um, I do love I do love the In and Out. No. Uh, and the closest one to <laughs> us is in um, Denver or okay. Salt Lake. So, yeah. So okay, we have to drive like four fun. hours if we want to go to in and out. Four hours? Okay. Oh, yep. So you don't. Okay, you, yes. You, you, must you, really love that. you have in and out, but you don't have it. Yeah, that's too far. That's really yeah. far. Oh, we got so five. only when we go somewhere that has it, that's when we stop. And that's one of our rules that we have if we're yes. traveling. Because you know when it, when you're traveling, there's a lot of out, going out to eat. Yes. Uh, so we go only to we try to go to only places we don't have in town. Right, no, and that makes sense, yeah. Because yeah. there's no point in going to McDonald's if you have a McDonald's, if you yeah, have six right. McDonald's yeah. in your town. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, wait a minute. So Samoan Watchman said, "Are those Samoan pancakes?" <laughs> 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 and then Nana Michelle said, well, "I'm glad we don't gain weight from pictures because John would have me weighing a thousand pounds." <laughs> yes, by all the wonderful pictures. Yeah, you're doing great. Wow. Uh, yeah, your pictures are really. Uh oh, Colorado. Is no, that no, no. That's is? Michigan. Is that Michigan? Oh, that's Michigan. Yeah, that was at the yes. playoffs last year. We were out there. Oh, we nice. got on the field. I like the colors. Oh, yeah, yeah the they've got the best good. color. color it is Maize good. and blue. Hmm. Michigan. So you went to school in Michigan? No, 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 no. But my brother went to school in Michigan. And oh, okay. at that time, Colorado had a lot of um, bad well, – both their team was bad, but also they had a, bad, a lot of bad issues because, like, that, there was, like, six or seven players that oh. were – that had oh. like rape allegations on them. Oh wow! And it's like, how can you root for a team with those kinds of scummy people? You know, it's kind of tricky. Yeah, that is. <laughs> so I'm kind of excited because Deion Sanders is the coach of, at Colorado this year. Oh, oh okay. okay, I forgot. About so him. I'm excited to see what he can do with this. I don't think they're going to do. I don't think they're going to go over 500. But yeah, but it, th- this was a cool trip. I mean, it was a cool trip. Yes. Okay. Oh, look at this. Nice. All right. So we yes, got to be just... in the end zone there. Mm-hmm. This was in, this was in Phoenix. So, okay, okay. nice. I have not yeah. been to a football nice. game in a hundred years. <laughs> I can't even remember how to watch football. <laughs> like, mm-hmm. We'd be lost we are really lost. yeah. It's been a while. Wow, that's cool. Well, thank you so much for sharing. Let me let me spread us back here apart. That's really that's nice. That's the farm I live on there. Oh wait a minute! You're Ooh. killing me. Hold on. <laughs> Every time. I know. He keeps drawing you back in. He keeps drawing me back in. Wow, that's really nice. Look at those trees. Nice. Yes. I see the snow. See, mm, that's scary. Yeah, that's, that's that scares like, me. That's like us. Like, mm. yeah. <laughs> oh, snow. <laughs> we, we we have a uh uh well we like to call a six flags ride. We call our driveway. Yeah, it's not good in the in the snow. <laughs> it's not good. But that's beautiful. Wow, that's nice. Wow. Now, do you have any animals that I've you got, raise? I've got, uh, no, we were trying to, trying to do chickens, but I, I just, it's kind of hard. So we just have the two cats that we have for our pets. Yeah. Mm. But, yeah. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah. They're fun. Like games. Professional mm-hmm. sports are fun to watch. Or even mm-hmm. the college ones are fun to watch. Yeah. I think the college ones are better. Than They're that. much. Okay. Look at that. No, that's better. Yeah. No yeah. snow. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Yeah. Well, we have amazing skies out here, so. You do. Skies. Oh, that's and beautiful. It's... You should paint that picture. I that actually sky. do have a painted version of that, too. Somewhere. That is pretty. Yeah. I can see it right there. I yeah, like that sunset. Yeah, that is beautiful. All right. So that's, that's like, it's nice to, you know, to, yeah. to be out in the country and, uh, and uh, be be kind of, you know, 
I, it's nice because we have like it's not like a big city. It's like it's not like Philadelphia size type of city, mm-hmm. you know, or mm-hmm. Denver size city. But we have a you know, I mean, the, this, there's like three cities, and it becomes like a metropolis almost, you know, metropolitan mm-hmm. area. Um, mm-hmm. And but in that greater area, there's probably about close to like a hundred thousand people. Yeah. And the whole valley, there's probably about five or six hundred thousand people that live here. Right. <laughs> but where do you live, at, John? I live in Colorado. All right. Colorado. Yeah. <laughs> so, but I, but it, it's kind of crazy because it's like whenever I, whenever I go into town, I just no, like today no. I was so grumpy. I'm like, I don't like going into town. Right. I hate driving in traffic. I hate. <laughs> yeah. And you're like, calm down. Like you only have to do that once in a while. <laughs> right. Yeah, exactly. And now that my wife um, and my wife works from home, we don't have yes. to go into town every day. Oh, thank the Lord. <laughs> I hate yes. going into town. <laughs> You can milk a cat. Okay, Dave. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, he's pretty bad. You see me, parents? Yeah, it's something like that. Yeah. <laughs> well, thanks for sharing so much. That is so cool. Oh, no, he's killing me. Here's another one. <laughs> what is it just saying? This is, um, this was a, this salad. was, we, we, we did a, we catered my parents' 50th anniversary. Yeah, I see salad. I see some zucchini and squash. Yeah. Wow. There was all kinds of stuff. We had like uh, asparagus and and Ooh. salmon, and we had chicken and. Wow. Okay. That, I mean, that looks great. Cats don't lay as many eggs as chickens, right? Oh my goodness! I don't know what's happening over here. Um, <laughs> Side conversation. Twilight Zone over there. Meet the, yeah, meet the parents. Oh, okay. Okay. Did he get my reference? Yes, and then and then. Uh, <laughs> Ursula's saying that looks delicious, John. Yeah, that looks really good. Okay, sunflowers. Maybe? So I took I took this picture and then I did the art effect on it to make it look yes. like a painting. I see. That's very nice. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, Maybe. I love I yes. love a lot of photography. I do. It's, You're doing great. I, wow. Wow. Oh, Daphne, do you want to step away for a minute? Okay. Me. Oh, thank you, Daphne. Thanks for coming in. In Montana, you always have to, if you're ever in Montana, you need to get a Huckleberry shake. If you've not had Huckleberry, Huckleberry. it's it's amazing. I have to look up what that is. (laughs) It's like a raspberry. It's kind of like like a mixture of a raspberry and a blackberry. And then, Mm -hmm. you know, but oh, oh, it's so good. Huckleberry pie is so good. Oh, like Huckleberry Hound. Yes. (laughs) Yeah. Huckleberry Huckleberry, um, jams are good. Huckleberry, Mm -hmm. like Telemuk ice cream does a Huckleberry ice cream. And that stuff is like... I bet that that looks good. But yeah, that does this, look good. This is like the largest truck stop in Montana, and they have like these shakes and the fries yes. and the burgers, and and they have these signs like for sixty miles out. Don't forget the best right. uh, 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 Huckleberry shakes in the world. You know. Wow. Yeah, that that looks great. Let's see. So uh, Daphne's running. Thanks for coming, Daphne. And uh, uh and let's see. Ursula's saying no. John was saying they had two cats. And they didn't get the chickens. That's right. And I was thinking, no, that's right, yeah. well, there goes the that's eggs. That painting yeah, you... I was telling you about of the, yep. of the farm well, That's did. beautiful. Yes. That's nice. Wow. That's neat. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes. And your catered meal looked delicious. You have a few. No, 10. 10. That's your score. <laughs> a couple scores. People saying it looks good. Wow. And there's Kitty. Now, what, what's the cat's name? Well, because I'm a Lord of the Rings fan, his name is Strider. Oh, you named him what? Strider. Oh, okay. nice. Very nice. <laughs> very, look at those expressive eyes. Wow. He's a very photogenic cat. I mean, he tr- mm-hmm. truly is it's a photogenic very... cat. It's, it's, it's a picture of the cat. The cat's like, here, it, let me show you. Here's my. Uh... No, I thought it was a painting. Like, no, no, no. It's really the cat. <laughs> he's, see? Been, he's been kicking it up. I'm like, oh, the... yeah. Okay, wow. See how nice that is? <laughs> okay, wow. Yes. It comes out. <laughs> yeah, right yeah, it's like, well, Strider. Yep, yep. And, and David knows, like, whenever I stream, that Strider always has to like bomb the the, the stream. Oh you know? yeah, I've seen cats do that. What was you? You were watching something. My husband was watching something in the. No, it was a turkey that 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 bombed the guy's um stream. Yeah, there's this guy. He repairs like I, I'm gonna assume they're in either like Indonesia or Thailand, and he finds all these old factory equipment oh he made it put another one and a turkey decides <laughs> to like start walking by as he's like you know using an air gun to like pull up the bolts and stuff and then this guy just snatches the like he, like you're for dinner kind of thing like he pulled them out 
that's weird. That's from oh, that's that I that's from Shiprock, New Mexico. I made that. Yeah, you can tell that's yeah, that's New Mexico for sure. Yep, I got you. Yeah, yeah. let's see. Um Simone Watchman Love Strider. Yep, yep. Yeah, yep. This is good. <laughs> oh nice. That is yeah. awesome. Awesome, awesome. But you're 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 a busy man. Well, man I, of many I, like talents. I said, I love I love I love photography and I love video video design. I love oh. you know. <laughs> The cat is so my cute. cat is one of my muses, of course. I see. <laughs> my wife's like, I don't think I've ever met a man that loves his cat more than you. I said, probably not. <laughs> That's really good. Wow. That's impressive. But and, and he <laughs> yes, because he has such interesting expressions, you know. He like, does. Oh my goodness. Yeah. You know, now so let's see. Of... Wow. So Ursula's saying, um, in the movie The Tuxedo, they had to stop a mosquito with a killer disease called, called Strider. Strider. Oh, okay. Yep, I do love Jackie Chan or Slough. Yes, from getting out not to infect people. Wow. Jackie Chan. I forgot that movie. We saw that once. We had it. Yeah, somewhere. We yeah, I do. So we we have a lot of Jackie. We do enjoy Jackie Chan. Jackie Chan. Yeah. Jackie. yeah. Yep. And then, of course, you, you got to love my Lord of the Rings humor. Oh, yes. Yeah. What? One ring to rule them all. It's a. I'm you have to. Yeah, yeah, no, I know. Yeah, it's coming. No, but take a look. It's, you're, you're on a little bit of a delay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I have a, a 3D printer where I'm trying to 3D print a bunch of those. Mm -hmm. Those rings. Yeah, so. but his was an onion ring. <laughs> yeah, that was. <laughs> That's which, hilarious. Which to me is good. That's, yeah, yeah, I would eat that. <laughs> yeah, should have done it as a blooming onion. A and blooming onion. That, That's the view oh, from my driveway right there. Okay. Wow. All right. So we're coming over. So you have no idea we're coming over. Yeah. yeah right. Just, yeah. Come on over. Yeah. It, it'll take us like 18 days or something. Colorado. <laughs> yeah, that's a hike. I don't yeah. even know how long it would take. Yeah. yeah. It's a long. I was trying to think. I was like, well, 18 hours to Florida. So Yeah. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Got a little dusting. Yep. And that's my yeah. that's my Red Ranger truck that I bought for 3100 I love it. And then my Toyota car. And then um I that's a F one hundred I have. I work mm. on that. That's like kind of a pet project, but okay. So. Wow, <laughs> that is really nice. Now let's I love see, I love old Ford trucks. So you like Ford? Okay, but yeah, the old Ford trucks. No, because nothing after Ford. like nineteen like two thousand one, two thousand two. Ford just went yeah. to crap, you know. And well, mm, yeah, I would say. <laughs> let's see. Um, oh, okay. So Ursula's saying, John, would you know how to export a video? To to like get a whole bunch of clips and be time lapse videos, seeing yeah. as you know something about tech. If you do, I may email you. Oh, she okay. she could use some tech help. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, and I do a lot of video editing stuff. And mm -hmm. there he, he is, is again. Look at him. Look at him. He's just so he cute. is. Yeah, he looks like a uh, yeah. Like and a my mom. dad looks like he just has amazing stripes and colors, and it's mm -hmm. just you know. Aww. Just, yeah, I can't. Just uh, yeah. <laughs> I know. Yes. Let's see. So, and then, so uh, I'm available for your pet, your pet's photography. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. That's good. And then Samoan Watchman saying, "Go forward." Well, fix or repair daily. Um, yeah. So anyway, <laughs> I made some homemade meatball sandwiches there. Oh, what homemade meatball sandwiches? No, we uh, we yeah, haven't we, done that. No, yeah. We were. Did we do that? Oh, no, no, not no, lately. No, no, not no, lately. No, yeah, that, you gotta remember. That. Yeah, we enjoy we enjoy meatball subs. Oh, I love meatball <laughs> subs. We enjoy those. That's why I'm like, oh, I, I, I always tell That's people I'm not I don't have any Italian or Mexican in me, but I love <laughs> But you love all the food, right? Yep. Yeah. So can you drop John's link? Oh yes, John. Type Kelly in the chat. Are you able to? Uh, I will, yeah. Yeah. I'll yes, please, because people want your link. Okay. And you can link up together. Link, link, link. No, that's beautiful. <laughs> That is amazing. Okay. Yeah, John, and also he sings karaoke too. Oh, does he now? <laughs> yes, he does. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, no, look at this. A man of many talents. He so is that, a Remember man. that mountain? That mountain that was from my driveway? Yes. That's the largest flat top mountain in the United States, in the world, actually, now. It used to be the second oh. one in the world, but it's now the biggest one. Um, hmm. And so, on top of it, during the fall, you can see where the yeah. aspens turn color and mm -hmm. you get the. Beautiful, too. Look at that. Uh, oh, there it is. And then it popped in underneath Nightbot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yep. 
So you got a double hit. It's, I figured as soon as you type it in, it would, it would kick it out, right? <laughs> but anyway, that's good. Yeah, I, I didn't know. I was just <laughs> it's just kind of like you know. But you know, like and then I there's the email too as well. Yeah, that's beautiful though. That's good. Yeah, so check out John. There's his email. Granny wants to know if we need the. Uh, oh, we did. Like, we did. Yes. Pizza from scratch. Yeah, we did make okay. it from scratch. Ready for your heart to melt, Kelly? Yes. Oh, kitty! I know. I'm all like kitty. <laughs> Very cute. Aw. See, I need a cat now. <laughs> you need a cat. <laughs> we need a cat. I do enjoy cats. <laughs> I, I and I love him. He is just the he is so he is adorable. He's yeah. adorable. Yeah. Although he is he, annoying. He has broken a television. He I got a <gasps> I bought a shelf for new DVDs and Blu-rays that I bought from the secondhand store. I got the shelf from the secondhand store and I put it in the house and he got on top of it and knocked it over. He wedged himself. Oh. In <laughs> And I was like, mother! You know? yes. <laughs> so my wife knows if I cuss, it's usually because I'm messed up in the kitchen or because I'm talking about right. cat. You know? Yeah. So, wow. But, That's uh, terrible. But, so I realized, uh, okay, I got to put it over here so he can't get behind it at all. Yes. And wedge himself up, you know. Or you have to like put it in the, um, you have to put it, you have to like attach it to the wall or something. Yeah, because right. cats are crazy. They do climb. So hey, Wanda, come on in. Welcome in. Yes. Good to see you. So anyway, so John was showing us some of his beautiful food and photos. Photography, yeah. <laughs> and photography. Oh, okay. Look, and... look at this. <laughs> it's um, he's grilling. Oh. Those were grilled pork chops I made. <laughs> Ooh, that looks yummy, John. <laughs> <laughs> so you don't need to go out to eat if you live near me. I well, clearly we need to we we need to make that drive. <laughs> That's what I'm thinking. Yes. Oh. We we enjoy people who uh, old mechanic is in old mechanic yeah there he is. he said oh my <laughs> how are you <laughs> and Wanda's here an old mechanic thanks for popping in yeah we're talking about food we always talk about food in these live streams right that's usually so where that, it goes that sky again from the property yeah that's beautiful you know, so John <laughs> John's in Colorado and these are some of the Colorado scenes yeah yeah we got to make sure of pet John I add you. <laughs> mm. Yep. So you're so you're 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 making friends and we call it influence we yeah. making friends and influencing people. Influencing people. people. Yeah. Yes, we, influencing we people. And, uh, and then I'll are. I'll show you. I did I did this kind of thing and I at where I would take these old cabinets and I made them into planner boxes. That's a good idea, actually. Because someone donated them to me. Now mm -hmm. they don't last too long. They only right. last a couple of years because obviously. Uh, you know, you can still put I you can still put something mm -hmm. to help with like the weathering, but in the water, yes. the rain, but right. it's still you know. Mm -hmm. Looks good. Oh, okay. So, um, oh. Ursula's saying she can't find your email address. He put it in the chat. Let me see if I can go back up. Oh, there it is. And it's actually his channel name at gmail dot com. Yeah. Yep. I found you, John. I had you. Oh, that's cool. That's my barbecue right there. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, <laughs> gee, that looks good, too. Ribs. So those are homemade scalp potatoes, baked mm -hmm. beans, corn on the cob, yeah, uh, toast, you know, French toast, and then those are mm -hmm. the ribs. And that's and another thing I love to do is I love ribs. I love making ribs. Yeah, those look great. So, wow. Like I said, I just... <laughs> yes. I do love my food. I, I... Okay. You know, it's nice. just... Uh, I love making well, food. So. And I think that's, well, that's the good. ingredient. I think that's the important thing because a lot of people go, I, I'm not good at making it. And it's like, well, just do it. You know, like this, if you yeah. like it, I think you'll enjoy it. Though this is, this is a picture of my potato soup. Okay. Bacon. Yeah. This is what we want. I mean, we may have to try, I ha may have to get that recipe from you for that. I will one. give it to you. Okay. I appreciate it. But yeah. That so yeah, really that's good. got bacon in it and, 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 mm -hmm. uh, and then carrots and, uh, um, And then uh, not cumin, but, uh, celery, the leeks, and then yes. um, and then there's the ch cheese and a little bit of sour cream and the chives on mm. top. And mm. and the important thing I have to stress, if you're going to make potato soup or any kind of cream-based soup like New England clam chowder, yes. do not use actual milk when you're making it. I believe that. Oh, yeah. Curdly, curdly. Because you'll, you'll burn, you'll burn, you'll score. And that's where that bad milk, burnt milk taste. Everybody yes. eats it. Yes. So please use evaporated milk. And then at the end, you can kind of, if you want to cream it up right before you serve it, you put a little mm -hmm. bit of milk in there. 
so yeah. you don't scorch it that that's fine Good. okay and then also was... you want to make a roux for that as well and you know, the roux, you know how to yeah. make a roux i do yeah <laughs> so yeah i do homemade roux for that as well okay so you're like okay you are fancy very fancy that looks great that is so good. So, yeah, so there's I, Michelle. Let's see, there's Melanie. That's awesome. Yeah. But uh, oh, and Nana Michelle saying, "Me too." At Granny, oh, I'm Granny Square. I love all soups. Yep. Yeah, she said that looks good. Uh, Ursula. Well, there's a local it. place, and we they make these peach margaritas. <laughs> now, okay, I can't say I've ever had that peach. Wow. Oh, it's it's good. If you if you like peaches, peaches mar mm -hmm. peach margaritas are great. Wow. Now, is it strong or medium? Would you say uh, it's medium because I think they realize they want to sell as many as they can. Okay, they can make stuff too strong, you know. Yeah, you'll. Uh, again, nice. here's a Mexican. Re so there's that. I love that Mexican food. I just, mm -hmm. you know, mm, that looks yummy. Yeah, I see the beans. I see the and rice. then they, this place that I go locally, they have like they make like a, it's like a like a homemade kind of like a pico de gallo. Yes. But they make it with like a cabbage. Oh, different. So it's like a cabbage salsa, and it's like the bomb, mm. Kelly. It's like the bomb. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> so uh, so Joy said she's never eaten a leek. She doesn't, yeah, she doesn't, she said, she, I cannot say I've ever eaten a leek. Yeah, leeks are really special. And um, sometimes I've, I've only seen them at my farmer's market like once or twice when I've been there. And I bought them one day because they were sort of on clearance, and they were good. Yeah. Yeah. So potato and leek soup is good. Yep. Oh, that's pretty. So the yeah, that's my wife's aunt's house in in Western Washington or Eastern Washington. Mm hmm. We went yeah. there last year, and that's where I took the that picture of the of the flowers on the driveway. I, I loved it. I just mm -hmm. their house was. I like. I can I come back here and live here? Can I live here because <laughs> I love you? trees. You know, it's like. Yes. You know, I, and, and this was their property. I took, you know, I love the flowers. I love taking pictures of flowers. Those are really pretty. Wow. That's really nice. So it's beautiful. I, I yeah. do like photography. I really do. Mm -hmm. So let's see. Ursula's saying we don't have Mexican food here. Lots of Asian food, Chinese food, Indian food, sushi. That's about it. Yes. That's the only place I don't think um, the Mexicans have gotten to, to South Africa. Yeah. I don't think they've gotten that far, but. Yeah, you know, eventually, I think you'll you'll probably have some food like that. But yeah, yeah I think you will good. eventually. They'll, they'll, they will eventually because yep. you know it used to be like places like Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. My, I have a uh, my sister in law lives in Pennsylvania, and I, mm -hmm. I she's like, oh yeah, we have a pretty good re Mexican restaurant. I said, there's a Pen they've got Mexican restaurants in Pennsylvania. And she's like, they've got Mexican restaurants everywhere now in the United in the continental United States. It's so. true, it's true, <laughs> because the little town we used to live in, it was funny. I swear to you, it was like March. And then in May, there were suddenly Mexicans. Like it, they just went <laughs> and they appeared. And then we started getting all these taco places and things like that. It was very strange, but it was good, you know. But I just remember going, wow, we never had Mexicans this far east before. Yeah. Yeah. Steak and mm -hmm. baked potatoes. That looks really good. <laughs> That's a big <laughs> baked potato. <laughs> it is. You got to have those big bakers. Mm. Yeah. Um, nice. Oh, that one of my favorite dishes to make is this yes. right here. Okay. And it's like a fried potato, onion, yes. uh, green onion, or green uh, peppers, bacon, cheese, skillet type thing. And skillet I put it in a cast yes. iron thing. Cast iron? Yeah, True. cast iron skillet. Right. Now, how, how many cast iron skillets do you have? Oh, um, one, a four, five. Yep. Um, I have like four big ones, one or four big ones, one medium one, one small one, and then I have mm -hmm. a cast iron Dutch oven. All right, nice. Oh, I'll wow. tell you what, man, those those are nice to have. Yes, especially <laughs> if you ever lost power and you needed to bake something. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Or if you're, you know, because my dad taught me how to like bake in, uh, you know, when you go camping, and people are like, what yes. you're gonna make? You're gonna make homemade biscuits and gravy on the campsite? I said yes, with oh, this okay. Dutch oven. So yes. <laughs> yeah, Ursula doesn't know Spanish. She knows six languages, but yeah, there's no Spanish people there. Yeah, so eventually she's in South Africa. So you never know. Oh, cool. You know? Yeah, they We've might. Always come wanted in to there. go there. Yeah, it's pretty. I've seen pictures anyway, but uh, yeah, that's amazing. So you have one. Oh, she said so. You have one for each day of the week. That is correct. <laughs> 
think you said seven, right? Yep. Yeah. That's really cool. Oh, so. Okay. Yeah, she said she loves what's in that pan. Yeah, so you guys, if you don't have cast iron, you know, definitely if you see them in the uh, thrift store or wherever, you know, Facebook marketplace, try yeah. to get your hands on, on one because, you know, once you season it, they last forever. I mean, old mechanic has some old ones too. Oh, there's Kitty. There he was when he was a little baby. Yeah. Let me put that. There we go. Very nice. Look at like, just like his eyes. His just eyes are just in the mm, white paws he's and it's hanging out. You know, <laughs> he's he's just hanging chilling. out. Just hanging out. <laughs> I, yeah. People give me a, a, a hard time because I I gave him like four names. Oh, okay. And but that goes back to you know the whole T. S. Eliot poem about cats, which they made the musical based off cats off of that. <laughs> and he talks about like how you got to give your cat at least three names. An ordinary name, an extraordinary name, and a name yes. that only means something to you. That's right. Yeah, I saw cats actually <laughs> on Broadway way back. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah, was I it did. Good? Yes. Did you enjoy it? It was so weird, but it was good. Yeah, it was so good. And um not to not to do spoiler alert, but they had a cat that sort of acted like Mick Jagger, which I thought was hilarious. <laughs> that that is hilarious. <laughs> that was hilarious. Yeah. But they I had all the funny. cats. Mm -hmm. it was it was great uh, but the makeup the thing is the makeup is so bizarre and they're acting like cats right and they're you know humans <laughs> and, you know dancers are they're very very limber and they're doing like the cat stuff that cats do the other <laughs> so thing i like to get to and find from secondhand stores are these old-time beer steins yes that's a nice one. Ooh, that's a big picture you, yeah. usually they're very small like the pictures yeah. that's a nice one Let's see. Oh, we got Crafty Mom Creations. Hello. Good to see you. Yes. And then Ursula has this. They have these um, planned blackouts in South Africa. They call it load shedding. Oh, I've so heard about she that. Does, yeah, when she does her live stream, she has to sort of cut them <laughs> a little before. Yeah. So she can I wonder why they... I, and, I wonder uh, if that's just because they're trying to e equally distribute the power out because of resources and limited... Re I don't... You know, that's what they have to do I sometimes in big the, cities. Uh, yeah, she'll tell you. She'll tell you if she's still here. Yeah, she'll she'll tell you. But, uh, but yeah, that. But you know, a couple of times, like she had to say, "Oh, I gotta. I can only live stream an hour today, or a couple hours. I gotta get out of here. You know, in and out. So that's what she has to do." Oh, sh stopping by to show some love. Hey, thank you so much. Yes, uh, Crafty Mom Creations. Nice. Thank you. I appreciate you guys stopping in. Also, yeah, this is great. Well, thank you so much for sharing, John. You really, you really. I mean, we. See, now I, I don't know what to do if I ever interview you. <laughs> oh, I, I can go into a lot of topics, trust you, me. You covered a lot of stuff. <laughs> I, mean, I, get you. I painted the brush. We can call this the, the, the de facto interview, right? <laughs> I mean, almost. almost. <laughs> I'm sure we can find some. We have to find some more, but that was great. I mean, that was beautiful. You know, your food, like he's got some awesome food. Oh, tell us about your channel, John. Uh, John. Just in general, I mean, you sort oh, of just in general. It's I, I got different. It's got a variety of stuff. I do kind of mm -hmm. like I like doing IRL videos, and um, I've been I've been making I've been working on a couple of documentaries. Like I'm so I'm aspiring to do that stuff and working on that, and okay, that takes a while. And then I yes. um, I'm gonna be starting a uh, here in, at the end of August. I'll be doing my uh, street. I'll be streaming my uh, a, a weekly uh, college football show because I love college football so. okay nice but, uh, awesome yeah so all right just it's yeah no that's good yeah thanks for sharing and let, let's get lydia in here too i want to make sure yeah so you, you can tell us her. about your channel i'll make you big real quick and then uh um bam. i do videos on my channel i go lives being people up on the panel um i do have a facebook page Mm -hmm. Of freaking knitting needles, and so yeah, that's it. Do that. Okay. And how long have you been on YouTube, Lydia? Uh, Kelly. Yeah. Well, hey, I'm um, sorry. <laughs> Larry minds want to know. <laughs> Give me it. I really we're all my cowboy. Yeah, we're all in different. Uh, Stages, you know how it is. We're in different life stages, literally and figuratively, on YouTube and in life, right? I think I started in October two thousand thirteen. Okay, 
And, and did you start doing content then, or were you just like a watcher? No. Like, I was I was a watcher. I was a life. watcher before before mm -hmm. I started videos and going on mm -hmm. lives and all that. Yeah. Cool. All right. Well, thank you for sharing. I would say you give me a minute. Two, okay. I started in October 14, 2013. Okay. So you have an anniversary coming up soon. Not long. Yep. You know? Yeah, that's cool. Yep. Nice. All right. So thanks for sharing. Let's see now. Oh, so Ursula is saying her the, about the electricity. So in South Africa, she says, I'm not in a hurry to tell, but seeing as it's not my live stream, I can mention there is a lot of corruption. Okay. Regarding electricity and elections are coming up. So all kind. Oh, okay. So things oh, are happening. Okay. Uh, Interesting. Yeah, I can, I can understand how that, that's yeah, yeah, that's it's, weird. It's, it's, it's insane to see that in places in the world where you don't experience yes. that yourself, you yeah. know? of seeing where re resources that you need, whether it be power or running water or, you know, clean water. Mm -hmm. Of course, we've had places here in the United States, like Flint, Michigan, <laughs> where, oh. where we didn't have good water there, you know? Yeah. But, um, but I had a friend that was living in China for a while and she was telling me like just how much like mm. restrictions are on their daily life. Yeah. So. Wow. Yeah. That is interesting. But, you know, and then, oh, she's saying, okay, uh, the okay, uh, government says it's more demand than supply, but we had a few whistleblowers. Okay. Ooh. To Google, it would be best. So why does South Africa have load shedding? Okay. Okay. Got yeah. it. Okay. Yep. So there it is. Yeah. And it, and it seems like, cause she does um, live streaming like on Mondays and Fridays and usually she tries to do three hours and then sometimes she has to, you know, cut it. So that's not good. <laughs> you know what I mean? It just really depends. So she tries, sometimes she has to sort of tweak the hours to fix it. But anyway, this is um, Sammy Joe's link. And then this is Lydia's. There we go. There's Lydia's link. I got my link so that way people can get me. Yeah, for sure. So there it is. All righty. Well, that was awesome. So I think, uh, yeah, we're, we're two, two and a half. <laughs> so I'm going to cut it. <laughs> well, you know, I'll always bring content, whether, yes, whether you will. want okay, it or well, not. Now I know it's non <laughs> content. Wait, wait, here's my, here's my writing pad. Here he is. That's a right. <laughs> yeah. <So> John's good. <laughs> That's really good. All right. Well, listen, thank you so much. I'm going to get, I'll do my final words and thanks you okay. guys for coming up thanks and sharing. Me. I appreciate it. But anyway, so like I said, eat well, you know, take care of yourselves, you know, peace and love to everyone. Thank you so much for coming. I always appreciate any time that you can spend here. And I'm glad you guys got to hang out with me a little bit today and, uh, you know, try to support those local businesses, local farmers to get that fresh food. And really it, it it's, it's a little extra effort, but you know, it's definitely going to pay off. And just remember um, a lot of us in the, in the United States are dying from food, you know, from eating too much, <laughs> too much sugar, you know, too much salt and things like that. So something to think about, you know what I mean? Just take care of yourself. And I have a lot of nutritional links uh, in the description box. So check it out. But anyway, oh, yes, I'm so glad. Oh, thank you, Ursula. You're, you're awesome. Yes. And uh, oh, oh, low shedding. Okay, so we will put this on the prayer list. I want to put that here. Yeah. Okay, just keep it put on our prayer list. Some, um, let's see, some days we have 30% power or, or no power. Wow, that's terrible. That's oh, terrible. wow. Yeah, that's not good. Yeah, that's that's tricky. And we're spoiled here, you know, because things usually work, knock on wood. <laughs> you know, we usually don't yeah. fight for it. So anyway, but I'm so glad you, you could stop in Ursula because it's late or early <laughs> for you. And yes, please get some sleep, Ursula. And like I said, take care. Oh, yeah. thank you so much, Joy. Yes. Take care, everybody. It's been fun. So uh, anyway, I guess what we'll do is we have two minutes. We have one minute. <laughs> I'll get to 2.30. I may as well. Uh <laughs> you yeah, as well. Yeah, may as well. One more minute. So anyway, so thank you so much. But that's my evil plan. Let's all eat well. Let's all try to keep. And let me know whenever you get a chance if you've tried some of these, you know, recipes and if they've worked out for you, because like I said, the Dollar Tree pizza crust is amazing. <laughs> you know, with the, like I said, I'm glad you told my birthday, me and my other, uh, about yes. that. yeah. 
and it's it's a little bit on the smaller side, but it's decent. You know, it looks pretty good so far. I'm going to try it, you know, in a bit. But yeah, it's great. And uh, thanks for coming in, Wanda. And Wanda, yeah, check out Wanda's channel. She does budgeting and she does some working out and things like that. So, you know, like I said, let's all support each other. Peace and love and, uh, you know, happiness and things like that. So, <laughs> and I think that's it. Woohoo! We did it. <laughs> we did it. We did it. I feel like uh, Dora the Explorer. <laughs> we did it. <laughs> you know, that's all. We, did it. we did it. We did it. Louis Simos, we did it. <laughs> okay. But anyway, have a good weekend, and I will see you soon in the YouTube streets. And thanks for watching. All right. Take care. Bye. Bye.